Yo. <laughs> oh, dude. Yo, what's up? What's up? I'm excited. Happy Friday. How's everyone doing, man? Oh. Dude, I have a crusty ass throat right now, man. I think I'm getting sick. I think I'm getting sick, dude. No. Why is it always the long weekends I always get sick, man? You're my It's fine. Um, Chubby is in the call already, but he's getting a drink, so... We might just hear him scream at some point, indicating that he's back. Not before the move. Yeah, I know. Worst timing. Long weekend, and I'm about to move house, and I get sick. I just hope it's not the spicy cough, you know, the Rona. You know what I mean? Yeah, how you doing, Rona? What's up, man? How's everyone else doing? How the folks? Oh. oh, man. I hope it's a good show today. I don't think any other presentations. Let me just check the schedule. You've been Rona? No, I've had Rona once. I've had a singular Rona. Let me just check the schedule, see if anything's already... Summer Games Fest schedule. Are there any other shows we can watch? I think all the rest of them aren't, haven't happened yet. I know that the Summer Games Fest happened this morning. Like 3 a.m. for me. Um, but I don't know when the rest of the shows are. Yo, Flo, what's up? I don't... Has Day of the Devs happened yet? Oh no, a lot of these have already happened, I think. Yeah, I think okay, I think we can watch I think we can watch Summer Games Fest and then we can watch Day of the Devs. Depending on how good it is. And then Devolver's one is also done, I think, as well. The only ones that we can't see because they don't they haven't happened yet is the Future Game Show. They named a show after me. We can't watch that one though. Uh and then there's the <laughs> The Starfield Direct. Oh, God. <laughs> they got a whole Direct for Starfield. Oh, there's also the PC Gaming Show as well. Uh, but those are later on. I'll have to watch those some other time after my break. Oh, yeah, man. I'm getting sick, dude. I'm coughing. Where's Chubby? He said he was getting a drink, but he's been gone for, like, the whole intro time. I don't know where Chubby went. This must be filling up a big ass cup, dude. Maybe he fell and can't get up. Hey, McFarlane. Guys, you, I, I, man, I'm so proud of myself. I did not touch, I didn't touch Reddit. I didn't touch YouTube. I didn't touch Twitch. I did not go anywhere near any Summer Games Fest spoilers at all. I've been completely unplugged today, dude. You don't you don't notice how much you browse social media until you stop doing it, you know? I was itching. I was like, ah, need my fix. I had to actually do work at work, man. That sucks. I'm not used to that. Uh, classic. But yeah, so I'm completely spoiler free, which has never happened before. You know what always gets me? I, I never click on the YouTube videos to actually watch them, but it's always the thumbnails, man. YouTube has spoilery ass thumbnails all the time. And obviously the, the titles of the games and stuff are pretty spoilery too. Like if there's, if there's like some crazy sequel coming out, then you just see it in the title. It's like, you're doing two. I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. And then you know what's coming? Spoilers mean clicks? Yeah, true. You should stay away from Reddit for the solidarity with the API bullshit on Monday. Oh, yeah, I've seen a lot of that. The whole going dark thing. I haven't looked into what the changes actually were to the API. What are they doing to it again? Are they making it paid or something? Or like locking, locking out third-party apps? 
Notice that with Zelda clicked on a video, there's crazy spoilers everywhere. Yeah, Zelda's gone past the no spoiler period on YouTube for sure. I have to, I have to take, I have to, every time I see a Zelda video, I don't even read the title. I don't even like look at the thumbnail too much. I just press the three dots and go block off my feed now. Not that I don't want to watch it, but. What the know, hell do you know? You're just a bumbling dimwit. I know a lot of things, Metro. I know a lot of things. I know a lot of things. I'm very knowledgeable. But everyone loves me for my knowledge. Yeah, Metro, what's up, man? They were just charging ridiculous amounts for it? For the API? Wait, wait, look it up, Reddit. I got time right now since Chubby's not here. Reddit API changes. Could have fooled me. Well, I actually have two university degrees. I'll have you know. Take that. Uh, Reddit API changes. Apparently The Verge has got an article on it. Uh, I know Apollo is shutting down. I, I read about that. Getting paperwork done to join the infantry. Oh. Godspeed, soldier. You have to do like 500 million push-ups to pass the test. It'd be like Captain America. Oh, hell yeah. Freedom. Yeehaw. Nah, that's cool, dude. Good luck with that. You'll do, you, I mean, paperwork. I'm assuming if you're getting paperwork done, that means you've already like passed everything you need to pass. Gone through the motions or is, or do you still have to like pass tests? I'm assuming there's some like tests you got to pass to join infantry. Uh, I'm reading this thing. Apollo for Reddit developer Christian Selig revealed that the his API hook would be costing him $20 million per year due to the API changes. Holy shit. <laughs> How much? How much for a single request? That's, that's all I want to know. It doesn't say. It just says that it's going to cost some people $20 million, but it doesn't say how much a single request is. API changes. It doesn't say. I just want to know how much it costs to make one request. Ah, whatever, dude. dude what's the bet Twitch follows suit? Guarantee you Twitch would do it. Twitch is going to do it soon. Knowing, knowing Twitch's management, they're going to be like, oh my god. You can charge for API calls? You gotta do a physical, other than that, you're good to go. No psyche Val? Or is that done? Looks like you're training for a minimum of eight months, but if I have things, I won't be able to be training for a year. Oh, damn, dude. Infantry training. That's tough stuff. Ah, you got it, though. I believe in you. Where the fuck is Chubby, dude? Stalling again. He said he was going to get a drink. That was like... Seven minutes ago. <laughs> Come on, man. I got some reacting to do. I want to react, bro. F for your timestamps tool. Well, it's it's twenty four cents per one thousand, so it it shouldn't it shouldn't affect my timestamps tool. I don't think. I hope not, unless it gets big. I heard. So Are you there? What gets big? Uh, my, <laughs> my, uh, my, my program. No, cause, cause, wait, wait. Sorry, hold on. I just had a massive brain fart. You know when your brain just goes blank? You like about to say a sentence, you just it just dies. Mid Mine constantly does that. 
<laughs> Why did it take you so long to get a drink? Uh, I had to go to the the water fountain, the next what? suburb over, and catch you know get get a pail oh, of water. Oh, you, uh, you had to go. Yeah, right. You had to get you carry the pot. I had to go to the head. source. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, cool. That's hard to do. You know, that's very high skill. Look, that's uh, a, it's, it's taken very, me months. Yeah, high skill cap. Gameplay. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, cool, dude. Are you, are you ready to watch the thing? I was yes. just whinging about you not being here. Typical. If I don't go a f several minutes without you in my life, I break down. I can't function properly. I have heard this. I've, I've actually heard one thing. <laughs> your family. <laughs> one thing. I do have to show you one thing. I have to show you you and and chat. There's one thing. <laughs> okay, I'm watching stream. Before we, before we, before we do. So, to give to give some context, okay. I was at a wedding recently of a friend of mine mm. um and and my partner and i we, we we took a photo um at the venue outside just, just sort of before the wedding got going and stuff um so i'll show you the photo hold on I, let me just let me just bring it up okay so i've 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 taken out my my partner's face um but i'll, I'll show you the photo okay and oh, and by the way, the, the, she she posted this on uh, her Instagram as well. I, I gotta I gotta point that out as well, just before I show you. Okay, just I'll show you the photo, and and you you tell me if you can spot anything that's sort of like off. You know, it's just sort of. You, you see anything sort of, not quite, yeah? You know what? I, this is on Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> Rock and stone. <laughs> I can't. This got posted to Instagram, dude. Look at my fucking... Oh, my God. Damn, you're a stallion, though. <laughs> okay, dude. Mm. I don't know. I don't think that's... <laughs> I don't... Because I, I had a wallet. I think it might have been my wallet or something. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, sure, dude. It's, <laughs> it's, definitely, it's definitely not my phone because my phone is the thing that's taking the picture, so it can't be my phone. <laughs> so, <laughs> Now I'm worried that I was just walking around this entire <laughs> wedding <laughs> with a <laughs> with like a massive heart raging on. Going on. <laughs> Oh god. Uh. <laughs> I, <can't. laughs> I, I saw it on Instagram and I messaged my partner. I was like, can you please take the photo down? She's like, why? <laughs> What's wrong? Uh, let's go. Uh yeah. That, that's what happened just yesterday. Uh, How long was that up before you checked it? By the way, <laughs> it was like the wedding was like a week ago. <laughs> it got like forty likes or something. Yeah, I know what they're liking, dude. <laughs> I can't. It was oh my! There was like five photos as well, and all of them. <laughs> Every single photo, I was, I, dude, I was bricked the fuck up. <laughs> Photo. Dude, everyone would have been looking at the wedding like, what the fuck is wrong with this dude? <laughs> <laughs> what did he I'm take so... before the wedding? <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed. Hey, Orca, what's up, dude? Oh, man. Yeah, that was... <laughs> and then she had to... The worst part is that she, <laughs> she had to tell the bride, <laughs> who's her best friend... Why she took the photo down because I look, she doesn't want to look like you know she doesn't. Yeah. <laughs> she's like, well, I gotta tell her because otherwise she's gonna think that I'm mean and that I didn't want to be at the wedding or whatever. It's like, do you really have to tell her? But I just had a ma massive heart on at the wedding venue. <laughs> the venue was just so beautiful. I just couldn't keep, <laughs> yeah, keep it, it was the keep it together. It was the scenery. It was the <laughs> it was the lake. You know, it's really <laughs> the atmosphere, the it vibe. Was the, it was so romantic. <laughs> <It's> just... <laughs> Oh, uh, just put a blur spot over it. What, like it's a Japanese porno? Just pixelate it. Yeah, okay, dude. Uh, perfect. <laughs> the, 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 the hentai look. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Anyways, we can watch some games now if you want. What have you been up to this week? How's your week been? Give me the give me the down low. I need my parasocial, you know. My my so apart sure. from getting bricked up at a wedding, um, mm. not a whole lot went on to be honest with you. It's just working, man. I just work a lot, you know. 
You know what I have yeah. been doing? I've been playing um, been Mafia doing... in my spare time when I haven't been streaming. This is how Mafia game. works. This is a decent game. No, not Mafia City. <laughs> the... <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a level 100 gangster. No, it, I'm playing the, the the remake of the old the old 2002 Mafia game. They, they did, you know, they redid the whole that's thing. That's right. Yeah. yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not bad. It's pretty good. It's it's definitely it's got aged gameplay for sure. <laughs> Um, it just but, makes no. me think about that video of the kid who won't go take a shit in his mom's drink. <laughs> 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 <Take a shit. laughs> You're oh, shitting man. yourself. <laughs> Is that, yeah. yeah. Apparently, apparently, by the way, that was that wasn't like a. I thought that was. I thought that was sort of put on, but apparently that that kid's actually. Um, yeah, I think he's, he's got a, he's got a YouTube channel and everything. Like he, they, that was legit. Like he was, his, his mom was, he was actually and he shitting uploaded himself. It. Yeah, and he uploaded it. Apparently he still uploads. I forget what the channel name is called, but, but uh, yeah, that, that kid's still geez. got a channel. Oh, <laughs> uh, that's fucked. Yeah, right. Nice. Anyways, uh, you ready to, you want to watch this thing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go. I'm, I'm hankering for some Summer Games Fest, dude. I've been, I've, I was just telling um, everyone that I've been, that I've been avoiding YouTube, Reddit, Twitch. Completely, all of it. All, all internet interaction, gone. All forms of social Absolutely media. Absolutely gone. Yeah. And then I had this moment of enlightenment, but then I put YouTube back on, so we're good now. Back to being <laughs> a DGen. Anyways. Ah <laughs> uh, yeah. Are you on zero? I'm ready to go. Mhm. Mm I've got go. subtitles on for you guys, by the way. Uh yeah. All right. You ready? Yep. Three. Two, one, click. Please welcome to the stage. Ooh, the okay. What do you think? Oh, we didn't do bingo. Fuck. Oh, John did bingo quickly. Wait, 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 yeah, yeah. Before we do anything, bingo. Wait, I forgot. I forgot. I forgot about bingo. A quick. Well, quick I, bingo. I, 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 I think I've seen something today, so I'm not gonna say it. I won't say it. If you've already seen it, if you've already gotten spoiled, you can't put it in the bingo. It doesn't count. Okay. Okay. I won't. Feel free to participate in the bingo, guys. Let me just bring it up. Uh, um. I'm trying to think what might. All right, should we do six this time? We always do nine and we never get enough. Yeah, yeah, do six, do six. It's hard to, it's it's really hard to actually guess that. Okay, we got six bingo slots. Uh, I've already got um, one. Uh, you got one? Yeah, yeah, I got one. What are you, what are you putting? There we go. <laughs> There's no way that's going to be in there. You do it like every it's, single time. It's going to be, it's this time for sure, dude. It's so close oh to being done. God. It's so close to being done. I'm put telling the, you. Put the clown suit on this, already, dude. Just this, accept it. <laughs> this, Just accept it. Oh this my God. Where is, is it? the time. It's going to be a so, date, a revised date. This will be you, buddy. Fucking 1st of January 2024, <laughs> dude. When, when, was the, when was the cutoff? I can't even remember. It was, yeah, it was the end of the year. It was okay. It was the end of the year, but it doesn't. It's it's gonna be. It's gonna be there. There's gonna be a date. The date's gonna be November. It's gonna come out in November. I'm gonna finish it by and December. Say, Ryan, we saved you right in the. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> they released it early in buggy just to get it out before. <laughs> so they knew. Okay. What, um, else, what else do we think? Oh, uh, I've not really been keeping up with like new game stuff really at all. So I'm like, I'm I'm just kind of mm. blanking. Diablo I'm 4 getting a $70 deal. Announced at Summer Games Fest, though. It just came out. This is, this is, we're, <laughs> we're doing the bingo of what's going to be on the show that we're about to watch. Remember that. Not, not what's coming out. Yeah, okay, I wouldn't put it past Blizzard. <laughs> Welcome to hell. Um, reforged. Some Blizzard remake. Shit Blizzard remake. Um,. I'm gonna, can we do like the general ones that we like we did sometimes where it's like yeah yeah, like yeah. A, we can do, we can do a, a, a remake of a game nobody asked for sort of thing yeah yeah we can do that you want to put that one on there yeah I kind of want to put that on there remake of game nobody asked for okay so that's a classic uh, hmm uh, I was gonna say sequel to game that nobody asked for but. I don't know. That's I feel like that's that's two very similar ones, you know. Mm, 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 mm. What about Gotcha Gotcha Weeb Trash Game? Oh uh, yeah, that, surely there'll be at least one of those. Gotcha Weeb Trash Game. Okay. 
There'll be yeah, farming yeah, farm simulator or something like that for sure. Three farming simulators. We'll go. We'll go with <laughs> one at least. We'll, we'll we'll be we'll be nice to ourselves. Okay, farming simulator slash Animal Crossing clone. Generic, uh, like a survival sort of game, you know, like uh. A... Oh yes, yeah, survival. Uh, yeah, yeah. Generic survival game. Is there anything positive? <laughs> We've got a lot of like shit. <laughs> it was so jaded. Yeah, do we, do we have anything that's not cynical? Anyone got any optimistic predictions? Anyone who hasn't seen it? <laughs> mm. um, Something positive, man. What, what, do we, what do we actually want? What do you want to see? What generic positive? Oh, fuck. Oops. I was, I, did I, had a, I, had, was, like, I was thinking You're about really the word. You're really trying to bring positivity. I was thinking about the word. I can't edit it, dude. How do I... Isn't there like a back <laughs> button? Undo. Generic. You're trying to type perfectly over the top. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to... Hold on. I got it. Look oh at that. Uh, generic. Oh, wow. Survival game. <laughs> Perfect. I don't know. Bold survival. Okay. All right. Ah, fixed. <laughs> fixed. Uh, yeah. What's what? What? Something positive. What do you actually? Okay. What, what do you actually want to see? Um, I actually don't even know what I want to see. To be honest, it's like life. I'm, you know, just lost. Are you just getting so jaded with gaming that that it's? There's nothing that can pull me from this despair. No. Actually, you know what I do want to see more of? That Lies of P game. That like Dark Souls Pinocchio thing. That looks fucking nuts. I really want to see that again. Isn't Maybe that like out? A date. That's not out. Is that has that already had a date announced? It's not I out. I thought I seen someone playing it today. Oh, okay. On Steam, I swear. Oh no, no release date twenty twenty three. You're right. Oh, it's it's already got a release. Oh, it hasn't September. got a release date. It does September nineteen twenty twenty three. Oh, okay, Steam. okay, yeah. nice. Okay, that was already announced before. Um, Why did I see someone? I swear, unless it, unless it was announced at the show yeah, that we're maybe. about to watch. Oh, it probably was. Yeah, you're probably right. And there was like a demo. My bad. Oh fuck, that's okay. Um, Elden Ring DLC. Ooh. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's, that's yeah, a good one. That's a good one. That's actually that's good. a good one. Elden Ring. <laughs> Elden Ting. Elden Ting man. All right, really. <laughs> All right, there we go. There's our bingo card. Nice. I think that's I think that's solid. Except for Silk Song. Uh, go back to zero. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm. It's end. It's doing that endless loading thing, but I think it's fine if I press play. I gotta, I gotta pause my music though. All right, I'm ready to go. I'm ready <laughs> for the gaming. Remember, don't, that's don't. Good. I always don't make the mistake of scrolling your mouse along the bar, because that yeah, spoils yeah, yeah. you as well. I gotta close my eyes and, and click play. Okay, no, it's fine. I, I didn't get any. I didn't get any bar spoilers. All right, you ready? Yeah. Count us in. Three. Two. <laughs> okay, dude. One click. Please welcome to the stage the creator of the game awards, Jeff. Keel. The creator. Dude, he's he's the creator of every Jeff. game. Oh wow. He, th this is the video game guy. He His makes brain all the video games. Is full of games. The, the game creator himself. Hello, everybody. Everyone that's announced at the Summer Games Fest is just his ideas that aren't real yet. <laughs> and then all the game devs have to like work their ass off to make it real. <laughs> Fever dreams, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look at that jacket. And it feels Damn. So to be in person How's the sound, guys? Is it? Is, 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 can you guys hear the show? The first time ever. Welcome, everybody. I don't want to be too loud or People too quiet. People pay to go to this, by the way, or is it just like, uh, like? I think no, I think it's paid. Or maybe it's a press yeah. event. I, no, I think it, yeah. I, don't remember. I, I don't know if it's just press or not. I think definitely like certain, certain booths and things are just press, but this, this doesn't look like press. Nah, that doesn't. Case. Nah. No matter where you play games, I John. The landscape of video game events has certainly changed over the past few years. But one thing has it? Hasn't. Oh there shit! Now he's taking a shot at E3, dude. And our singular goal Little today cheeky E3 jab. Oh yeah, E3 is not a thing anymore, is it? E3 is dead. A few minutes, I forgot about that. Extended gameplay. Uh, that shows you how cool it was Kombat if you just forgot about it. Mortal Kombat. What? 
What? Yes. Oh, we should have put Fortnite on there. Ah, oh, shit. Although Fortnite, uh, the Fortnite uh, epic miss. stuff, like the, the game I'll making right stuff, now. looks pretty cool. Oh, yeah. that's true. Let's get true. Right to the games and Yo, Oak, what's up, man? Just in time. The game show. Which makes it that much more exciting. Are there any Here companies that you know that are that are in this show? Surely you know one or two. What is this? What is this? Oh, is this wow. Prince of Persia? It's Ubisoft. It oh. could be. Yeah, I think you're right. Wait, did I just guess? Did I guess that right? The prince has been kidnapped. Nice. Yeah, it right. is Prince of Persia. Is that a it's remake cool. or a new one? Sequel. I don't know. Looks like a 2D sequel. A 2D new one. Whoa! Wow. Then again, they weren't prepared for me. Hey, it's too. Dude, it looks like, like Hollow Knight. Yeah. Oh. It's pretty much Silk Song. If <laughs> I take that off the list, we have Silk Song. <laughs> Perfect. That counts, dude. Dude, what is it with the... The rap music? Were you about to say that? Yeah, like rap yeah, music yeah. in so many fucking trailers nowadays. It's like, I don't know, man. Cause like trying to hype it up. It's just so weird. It's cause, you know what I reckon it is? It's because Riot does it all the time. Yeah, it's the Valorant effect for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cause Riot's trailer, everyone's like, oh my God, Riot's trailers are so crazy. So everyone's like, oh, how can we make trailers like Riot's trailers? True. Definitely has a, the Riot bud. You're not sure what's presented? Ah, oh, okay. Well, if you see any, if you see any companies that, where you know the people, you let me know. It's always cool to hear. Yeah, it looks like a Valorant trailer, dude. Brits. Oh, it is. A, it's an original game. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Okay, cool. That's cool. I'm not really a big fan of the Mate logo. I've never though. played Prince of Persia, so... I played Sands of Time, I think. That was pretty cool. I played the PS3 one as well. Yeah, right. Might turn it up a little bit. When did the last Prince of Persia come out? Like, that was a long time ago, right? Oh, a while back. I think it flopped really bad, so they just stopped making him. It was kind of like... Right. Bit dead in the water. Hmm. All right, let's move along to another iconic video game franchise. Iconic. 30 years. It is. Right. It's time for Mortal Kombat uh -huh. 1. Do you remember when I beat your ass at Mortal Kombat, the arcade bar? What? It has been four years since. I think you. I think you're having a delusion, mate. <laughs> what are you talking about? Remember <laughs> when I absolutely smoked you at the Mortal Kombat arcade? Reboots the series into a new era. I do not remember this. And it's coming this September. Actually, oh wait, the bar? Did yeah. you beat me? Are you sure? On the roster. Uh, yeah. Cameo fighters work. Surely. <laughs> okay, no maybe it was the other way around. You beat my ass. I think I remember correctly. <laughs> I actually can't remember, to be honest. We played, uh, we played Goldeneye, didn't we? Yes, of course. The fatality. Yeah, we did play Goldeneye. 1v1 Goldeneye? Yeah, yeah, we did. That was cool. Those controls are so jank, though. Holy fuck. Oh, shit. I actually didn't mind, uh, Mortal Kombat 11. <laughs> I was always bad at it though. I'm always shit at fighting games. I, I just, yeah, I'm like, really bad at fighting games. My brain doesn't. I kind of want to get Street Fighter though. Go before I put you Is that just because you're horny? You see all the. Th no. All the thighs? <laughs> Not because I want to watch Chun Li and Cammy in their alternate outfits. <laughs> oh! 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 Damn. Um, this is like a reboot, right? It's like a re rejig of the so story. Cool. Yeah. Oh! I always Why find the stories. Wait, what? Why are you fighting as like guys in suits? Where are the cool outfits? Who's that guy? Who's the CEO looking guy? Oh, shit! Damn. Oh, your shooter's in the list. Oh, nice. Not dead though. People play Mortal Kombat for the story. A lot of people play Mortal Kombat for the story. Yeah, I, I like it's. It's kind of like what, like a B, B grade action movie. Like similar. Yeah, no, I always find the stories are just so cringe and like. Who cares? 
I don't know. Some people cool. enjoy it. Oh, then again, some people enjoy the gacha game stories too. And I, fi and I find exactly. them horrendous. So. Exactly. It is what it is. I think it's like, it, I think it's kind of like for a lot of people, it's kind of like Fast and Furious. Like, like the stories are like shit. And like nothing that goes on really makes any sense, but it's just cool because it just gives people an excuse to like beat the shit out of each other, you know? True. And the characters themselves are kind of badass. Yeah. I just like playing as Kano, and then because Kano has this move where where you get to once if you beat someone, you can just like piss on them. <laughs> what? Yeah, he, yeah, he just he just he just pees on them, dude. Which takes the yeah. leak. That's hot. Oh yeah. my goodness. I do love the uh, the gory finishes in Mortal Kombat. They are very cool. That's like the thing with like Street Fighter. It's kind of like a bit like, you know, cartoony and shit. Yeah, yeah. Mortal Kombat's like real brutal. This is a long trailer. Holy shit. Yeah, for a fight again? Like, they couldn't have been half this. Not gonna lie. Oh, dude, you did a Crash Bandicoot spin. Did you see that? <laughs> what? Damn, dude. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? Wait, is the skinny guy Johnny Cage? Wait, is he just who? like a really skinny version of Johnny Cage? Johnny Cage is like one of the main... Maybe when he's young or something. But even when he's young, he's like supposed to be mega buff. Is he? He's like, he's supposed to be like a wrestler type. Oh! Oh my goodness! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> That's Kano, the guy with the the guy with the uh, eye thing. Oh my goodness! Holy fuck! At least they're showing what everyone wants to see, I guess. It's oh jeez! Like, over the top brutality. Oh, yeah, yeah. Damn. <laughs> what the fuck? Jesus. Oh no, dude. Chang Sung? What? Eh? They always have those pre order characters. Okay, that was cool. I mean, that was what'd you guys, what'd you guys think of Mortal Kombat? Now, I'm sure you have many questions <laughs> about what we just saw, and to tell you more. I am so honored to welcome to Summer Game Fest one of our industry's greatest creators, Ooh. a man who has been loyal to the same franchise and fan base for more than three decades. Please join me in welcoming to Summer Game Fest the Ooh. creator of Mortal Kombat, Ed oh. Boo! Ed Boo? Ed who? <laughs> this Boo. dude created Mortal Kombat? This guy? Yeah. yeah. This guy will rip your spine out of your back you. if you right, mess well, with him and, uh, first okay of all, thank you for that incredible uh, world premiere we got to see all the gameplay of mk1 and everyone just wants to know more about this because first of all this is gonna be funny if because like, it's the kind of the, the angle of the camera right now looks like they're in a fighting game yeah imagine yeah. if he just like pulled um, a finishing know, move on jeff right now the ending of mortal kombat 11 <laughs> like froze his neck ripped his spine out <laughs> <laughs> to, like, yeah. a fire guy, right? and he's chopped he's him up like some string cheese and this universe oh, this is yeah, we're dude. calling it mortal kombat one is because this is the beginning of a new timeline a number of these characters i love that classic it's like now it's an alternate universe so so Forget everything in it. Yeah, we we wreck we recon every now, mistake that we ever made because uh, it's, it doesn't exist anymore. Now allies and <laughs> that was all a fantasy. This is real. This is kind of now. <laughs> it's like what they did to Star Wars. It's just all the comics, all the extended material, all the old Republic stuff. It's all gone. None of it. None of it's none of it's not. The thing we gotta talk about didn't happen. Didn't happen. Cameos, because we saw Not important. Pretty amazing stuff there. Now, so tell There's no rules in there. Work. You obviously, you have your sort of your main, you know, character that you. Nervous <laughs> laughing know slowly you morphs into panic in the audience. <laughs> He's just slowly <laughs> choking yeah, him. In, in you just see more and more blood. A, His eye sockets. <laughs> After you do that, there's a second roster of characters. He's just squeezing his neck. There's a second uh, roster, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> you, got two, you got two characters. 
but they, a lot but of they, blank squares there. Yeah, so it's kind of like... Uh, I liked the new the new Kano look. I don't like how they make they make Kano out. bold you again, dude. Multiple times as you saw in the gameplay, you know, so you can piece... Jax looks like, like uh, the black dude off Halo. Characters. All the characters what's his name? <laughs> oh, yeah, he looks... Um, oh, oh, man, what's the sergeant? Johnson. Yeah, Johnson, Sergeant Johnson, that's right. The guy who yeah. smokes the unlit cigars. Yeah. For a brick, he landed pretty good. So how does that work? So you're in gameplay, you have your main, you have your some of them, uh, the classic. Off you, they come in, so it's not a tag team thing, right? Yeah, yeah. Did he exactly. die in Halo? And you're, you're basically summoning yeah. them. It's just one button pushes, basically. I don't think so. They have a variety, so you can go. I'm questioning this. He's, he's still alive in the ca in the in the in the Halo lore. Push it with down, like Halo cannon. Maybe he did die. So I gotta look some now. Oh, I see. So you can bring them in a combo. On exactly. Okay. Exactly. And and so. Oh, and tag like teaming! Isn't that what they do in uh, Dragon Ball Z? The Dragon Ball Z fight. Let's go. Indefinitely, but um, you call you can call them pretty much whenever you want, and they have you know like in the of the combo they'll have a lot of um, you know basically a whole arsenal of their moves. So Sony you saw come out. Does anybody actually play Mortal Kombat like appear twice in there. like play it properly? I don't play this. I feel like I should. I feel like I'd be more excited if I actually was a Mortal Kombat player, but. Cameos, are there some repeats from the main roster? How will that work? Yeah, he yeah, died so in the first one, then he was retconned alive and made a part of one of the Spartan well programs. The main Wait, was he? Was the Spartan <laughs> program thing <laughs> in like a book or something? Because I don't remember that. Oh, wait, yeah, he died. Didn't he die in like the in the in the super long Citadel level in the first game, like the, the flood level? And so there's, there's I think I remember. I think I, I think it's coming back to me now. Really surprised was I think you, you guys saw Goro. Yes, Goro. No, I think you're thinking of uh, Captain so Keys. A lot of like kind of really digging into the old. Oh uh, wait, he gets thrown into a flood thing, thing and explodes. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, or some uh, shit, doesn't he? Uh, really yeah. Somebody. Like, he might, it, I think. It, does Keys die in that in that massively long flood level that just takes forever? You know the one where you walk into the well, same corridor of, like uh, 15 times. Yeah, and then you get to him at the end, and I think he's been converted or some shit. I'm pretty sure. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I, yeah, he might. I Johnny guess Johnson King, died. Uh, <laughs> Did he die in the first one? What the fudge? I do not remember that. I, because I, I, I'm thinking of the, I'm thinking of Captain Keys. But I don't remember. I, I thought Johnson died in like a similar time or like the same. I thought he died at the start of that level. He was killed by the the little oracle thing. I can't tell you how many. The little, you know, the ball that follows you around and stuff. Um, you know, we are this close oh, wait, five, yeah, he gets shot. Him. Uh, so yeah, him. Yeah, right. yeah. I like how we're just not so talking about Mortal Kombat at all. Doing Johnny Cage yeah, I really don't care about this. Really how much time have we got? Wow, hey, wow. but uh, John, John Claude so Van Damme's in it. The action long. action movie star, right. Jean, Jean Claude Van Damme. Uh, secret to keep. I don't know. That doesn't help. He's like an he's like an old action movie star. Could not be more excited. I've never seen any of the movies that he's in. I don't think, but he's like some he's like some. I've heard the name from another movie that I watched where like one of the characters was obsessed with him. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he, he, he's he's like a, one of those action movie stars, kind of like uh, like uh, Chuck Norris or you know. What's the what's the martial arts do? Nobody asks. Now he's just like <laughs> some fringe. Thank you so much. First one. Uh, now he's just like a cringe. Everyone makes fun of him. Uh, Steven Seagal. Steven Seagal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen, I've seen some videos of him. Right. Oh, oh, action RPG. Oh, oh, oh. Another big and anticipated ARPG. I just saw it because I was changing my voice. <gasps> oh, wow. Path of Exile 2. Oh, are they going to drop another trailer? We haven't seen anything on the sequel in over two years. But I know. Right now. Oh. Look at a raw gameplay capture. Yes. Path of Exile 2. This is just like a massive update to number one, isn't it? To a new level. No, it's a legit new game, dude. Kind of, sort of. You're kind of right, but shut up. Oh, look how good it looks, bro. Where are the gods? Oh, dude, I can't wait to play this. What's going on? I'll play this when it comes out, for sure. Because it'll be free, won't it? Like, fuck yeah, it. yeah, it'll be free. I'll play this for sure. Oh. I feel like it'd be nice to get into it early. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully they, I just hope they revamp the new player experience. That's my biggest problem with Path of Exile is the, is the new player experience is just not good. At all. I always found it hard to get into it. That was the thing. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Because there's just so much to learn. It looks like good, this, though. Oh my good. Like, it does look really good. It looks wow. like as good as Diablo. Like, I'm not even joking. 
And Diablo looks really good. Is that it? No, oh, come on. Give me nah, it's gonna be more than that. Is it really quiet for you guys? It's really quiet for me. Let me turn it up a little bit. Yeah, it's a little bit. July 28. Was that the whole oh, thing? Find out more. Looks amazing and there's more oh my god, that was it! Last week marked the release of Street Fighter 6. Oh my god. At Summer Game Fest. Well, the team at Capcom has an important update to share with you. That was trash. Now. What? Is there already a DLC for this game? Character DLC or something? Yep. Is this, is this Street be. Fighter? Yeah. This will be a character DLC, won't it? Oh, no, it's, it's, it's Ryu. Or Ryu or it's whatever. a cosmetic DLC. Oh, you're probably right. Yeah, it's like a cyborg one. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, it's a skin. <laughs> what is happening? Wait, what the? Fighting a dinosaur? Wait, what? <laughs> what is it? What, what is it? I don't know what's going on. Jax. Oh, oh wait. Cool. Oh no no no. This I think this is like DLC for their dinosaur oh, no, shooting this, game. This guy. I thought that was Jax. I think that was Jax from fucking. <laughs> yeah. There's there's the Ex Exo Primal is like one of Capcom's other games. It's where you like shoot dinosaurs and shit. I guess they must be doing a crossover. Capcom loves their crossovers. They do. You're right. I'm guessing Ryu from Jurassic Iron Man. Fighter. <laughs> against a dinosaur probably wasn't on your bingo card. Do we need a dinosaur fighter? That sounds like a really good idea. Somebody make it happen. Dinosaur fighting game. Damn. Right, POE with no prior MMO experience, just completely lost, gave up on it. Yeah, it's it's even if you have prior MMO experience, it's still really tough to get into. There's nothing more powerful. That. Nick Cage. Oh, this is yeah. This is what I saw. This is a Nick Cage thing I saw. Yeah, that's right. Oh, you already saw this? <laughs> I saw something about it. Yeah. Hold on, wait. Don't don't say anything. Oh, I didn't right, realize no they were making a Nick Cage. Oh wait, this is is this the Dead by Daylight DLC? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, no, that's yeah, snooze. I don't care. Everyone just laughs. <laughs> Everyone laughing. <laughs> Surely he knows that's that that's right. like a joke. Is he a survivor or a killer? I, mean, I don't know how these things happen, but I'm assuming a killer. I figured the easiest way to find out is probably to go right to the source. This man's bold, creative choices have earned him an Academy Award. Oh wow, he's actually here. That's pretty cool. This can be like a incredible films. Please join me in How drunk do you think he is right now? Yeah, extremely. He's had like five bumps of coke. <laughs> yeah, like three rum and coke. His manager's like, you gotta do it, Nick. You gotta do it. <laughs> Get out on stage, Nick. And stop fucking <laughs> complaining. Put the coke down. <laughs> Happy to meet you. Nick, I gotta say welcome to the video game world. Oh, wow. Yeah, thank you. I'm so happy. I've never oh, played a video wow. game in my life. Very, very cool club, everybody. We're all a bunch of fucking nerds. <laughs> I, I actually hated Ghost Rider. I hate working on nerd movies. <laughs> I should have never done that. See, I always thought Nicolas Cage would be a great, uh, great guy for uh, Postal Five. You know. When I make movies, one of my favorite genres is horror. And in this, and, and in that genre, there's a character, a murderous ghost named Sadako, who I think is amazing, and she made an appearance in this game. So that's Sadako, my yeah. nuts, dude. That's, yeah, I mean that's what's <laughs> good one. one of the survivors hey. in this game. He's always ready. Cool He's always on the edge. He really is this <laughs> museum of horror. Michael Myers. You said all these different characters all coming together. Um, and you, do you pl you play yourself or who do you play? So I play this uh, heightened exaggerated version of a film actor named Nick Cage. <laughs> he's, uh, he's Wait, is he promoting his new film? Come on, dude. Talk about fog. video games, Nick. In the fog, he's by <laughs> We're at a video game and show. Killers, and it's rather amusing. And there's something about it that I think... Oh, wait, he is talking about the game. I thought he was talking about the other movie, the like way he played himself. Experience. It's a bit like hide-and-go-seek. You have your three other teammates who are... Oh, wait, maybe he is a survivor. Teamwork. You're working yeah, no, he is. He's just... He's, he's describing like a su survivor so gameplay right now. He should mention the fact that you have to just run around the same rock over and over again, just do circles. And then sometimes you have to press... Until they lose interest. Sometimes you have to press a button to throw a plank down. 
Nick Cage. That's, that's right. the whole. That's the whole. That's right. DVD gameplay right there. Even say, always remember to dress to match your talent. I want you to know that you're with me. That we're one. That we're fused. And so it was important to me that everything. What is he talking do, about, bro? Everything I say, from the scream to the grunt, down to the most minimal, exasperated expression of uh, a sigh, whatever it is, it's my voice, so that we are fused. All right. <laughs> what? Whoa, what? We got a fuse with Nick Cage? Yeah, you're a fuse. Like you enter my body when you play me. <laughs> you insert into me. Every time you log in to Dead by Daylight, I can feel it in my ass. I have a vibrator shoved up my ass. Whenever someone plays with me, it vibrates. Let me know. To me, was an opportunity to branch out. To I've never been invited into this space before. I'm always looking for. We're joking in the office. It'd be funny if he was playing all four survivors and the chaser, all of them being it from different films that he starred in. Nick by daylight. Nothing but a split second to say yes. And speaking about split seconds, what, <clears throat> excuse me, what I noticed, <clears throat> excuse me, sinuses, uh, allergies, what I noticed was that every That's all the coke he's <laughs> in the game. <laughs> it's like, oh, like, fucking <laughs> sinuses are just clogged up with, like, cocaine <laughs> rocks. <laughs> Solidified. <laughs> Years of abuse. Every sign you make has to be timed perfectly with the gamers moves. Yep. So that was something that the I The gamers moves. I love how you said oh, gamers. We love having you in the video game world. We want to see Nick Cage in more games. Thank oh. you. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Why is he back on the scene? Like, am I crazy? Like, I feel like he didn't do anything for like a decade or something, and then he's just like come back on the scene for some reason. Am I crazy? Has he just like ran out of money? It's just what actors do, dude. So weird. The chapter officially comes out on July 25th on PC and console, but PC players can try it earlier by downloading. He visited your main studio a few times, but of course you're in a different country. An exclusive first look at Nicolas Cage in Dead by Daylight. Well, while it shows what? this, I'm going to go get a drink because I really don't care. <laughs> uh, okay, see you, dude. Uh, ben. Oh, look at that gameplay. He dropped the plank just like he said. Just like I said he would. Wait, does that mean that you just spoiled Oak that you're working on DVD? Damn right I made it. Are you working on a DVD sequel? Did I guess it right? Oh, he's out of debt, so he's doing. Oh, so he's producing more movies as well. I think he's producing a lot of the a lot of the things that he's put his name on, like acting wise. Oh, what is, is this? The is this that witch? Is this that witchcraft shooting game? Oh, I think it is. I think it is actually. This looked really cool the last time we saw it. If if, if it's the game that I'm thinking of. I forget what it was called. It was called like Witch Hunt or something. I can't remember. A witch hunter. Oh, it is, I think. Yeah, this game looks sick. Why are the trailers so quiet? You, am I the only one thinking that? The trailer is like way quieter than the shows. Dude, I'd play the fuck out of this game, honestly, if it's good. We don't know if it's good yet, but like if it if it's if it's like as good as it looks. Which fire, that's what it's called. If that's as good as it looks, I'd be keen for that. Is this like an ad? Are you watching ads right now? Oh no. It's an actual trailer. I missed Dead by Daylight in some cringe ad. No, no, no. You missed, uh, you missed uh, Witch Fire, dude. That actually looks kind of cool. Ah, uh, did I? Uh, what is yeah, this, this shit? Uh, this is like some VR thing. I don't know. It looks really bad. <clears throat> Is CSGO? No? No. Uh, could? No, I don't think so. Nah, they don't have... You can't... Yeah, you don't drill Like, pull off some shit. Is it Rainbow Six something? Maybe. Let's go! I mean, it's... Oh, up. I know what this is. I, I think I've seen this as well, actually. Oh, you're getting spoiled all the time. Wait, is it Division? Yeah. Division view? Nah, oh, it's Cross... Ah, Crossfire. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah, dude. literally. That's like a who asked. Yeah, crossfire. <laughs> Yuck. Oh yeah, speaking of, have we got have we got anything off the bingo yet? Now that we're sort of in the in the ad ad period. 
Damn. Those monitors, like, aren't they like crazy expensive? Those yeah, Samsung ones. They are. Yeah, let me check the let me check the bingo. Oh wait, there's an extra trailer. What is this? This is Remnant Two. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I hey, tried Remnant multiplayer, isn't it? I did. I uh, uh, it is. I I tried Remnant One, and it was I don't know. It was okay. It, it felt a bit stiff. I don't know. It just. It's supposed to be a Souls like, isn't it? It is, but it's like it's got shooting in it as well. The, the problem is that it like doesn't do the souls like very well, but it also doesn't do the shooting very well. It just does them both kind uh, of bad. It's like this kind of bad middle ground. Yeah, yeah, it's weird. It's like too slow to be a good shooter, but too shooting like, to be a good souls like. I never realized it. Like, That's like part of the shtick. It's like Dark Souls with guns, basically, is like their whole selling yeah, point. It kind of feels like a fringe sort of selling point thing, I guess. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I tried it because I thought it'd be cool. I didn't really like it all that much. Maybe this one would be better. They're gonna be better know. co op though. Or did you play it co op? I didn't play it co op. I played it. I played it single player, and it, it might be better co op, sure. But everything's better co op. Watching grass grow is better co op. Through IRL is better co op. Aware. Feels like a wedding. Why? Because it's making you rock hard. <laughs> <laughs> it was flow there. I don't know. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> I hope there's context to that. <laughs> Nick Cage is going to be revealed during Games Fest, but it got leaked a few weeks by some game reviewers. Oh, okay. Uh, I didn't know that because I don't, I don't care about anything DVD related. I'll be honest. No. Oh. <laughs> look at the <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we have much more Summer Game Fest to come, including a first look at the gameplay of Alan Wake 2. The world premiere Alan of Wake 2! Fortnite, Call of Duty Season this is, Did we put... No, we didn't put whoever asked sequel, did we? We put remake. Dude, have we seen anything that, like, apart from, like, two seconds of Path of Exile 2, there's been nothing that I'm just sort of like, whoa, you know? Like, yeah. This has been kind of, like, mid so far. Did Xbox do a, a game show? Not No, they do. It hasn't happened yet. It hasn't uh, happened yet. Now, speaking there's still of so there's still two more that we can watch today. To later this year in um, a brand new game but the other ones haven't haven't style, haven't been on yet. Anyone put Very Bill Clinton <laughs> kid in their bingo? <laughs> oh, no. Where is her son? Where is her son? <laughs> That's such a good one, dude. You should have told me that earlier. We can replace something, maybe. Oh, new Sonic. I Dude, I always put down Sonic, I swear, dude. <laughs> the one it. time you don't put down Sonic? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> I swear, like the last two times we've done it, I've said Sonic. <laughs> Fuck, man. <laughs> this looks like actually good, though. It looks like classic Sonic. Cool. Yeah, they did, they did Sonic Mania, which was like classic Sonic, and everyone loved it. So I guess they're like remaking classic Sonic. Well, didn't they do Sonic, Sonic the new one, like Frontiers or something? Where it's like... Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the like, new 3D what, one. Like, what they call the open areas? Like, I can't remember what they called it. It's like something cringe as fuck. I don't know. I remember I it looked really it. bad, but people yeah, really it liked really, it. Yeah, really, really bad. Sonic fans liked it, but then again, I mean, Sonic fans are on on the. I think Sonic fans are probably on the hardest coping I've ever. Oh, that's dude, like, they're on like a, military It's like a special grade. special kind of like copium concentrate, you know? Yeah, that's yeah. That's like weapons grade. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's 3D they, they as well. Control of civilizations. Oh, wait. Oh, this actually looks brief. It's co-op. Wait, yeah, we can it play is. this yeah, it looks dude. Looks like four player. Looks like four player co-op. We could play this. I'd be yeah, down to play this. Sure. Yeah, I have played you Sonic for like ten years. Would you guys want to watch us play Chaos Sonic? Is anyone keen to watch us play Sonic? Oh, that's not far. That's like what? Fucking. I don't know when September fall is. I, I don't. I don't know the NA seasons. When's fall? NA people. Like when, when's fall? Like October. Fans alike. This past April, Honkai Star Rail launched, and as your oh, bingo. The game is bringing an exciting new character what? to space fantasy RPG. Shit, However, gotcha game. We don't just have a new peak for game. players, but also for those. Honkai Honkai Star Rail. Oh, <laughs> it's not already out as well. What the it's fuck? already out. Yeah, yeah, that counts. Yeah, yeah. That counts. I'm it crossing. counts. It counts. Yeah, yeah, no, definitely. Yeah. I'm surprised how much it's Wait. taken off as well. This has been pretty popular, hasn't it? This game. How do I get rid of the text thing? Hold on. Ah, fuck. I hope nobody cares about the trailer because I'm not watching it. 
Dude, they want to watch it, man. Get the fucking trailer back on. Sorry, You're sorry. The stream. Sorry. I want to see their furry characters. Fuck. <laughs> Whoa! I can't wait to waste thousands of dollars unlocking this five-star character. It'll all be worth it for the two percent damage buff I get on my rotation. <laughs> Dude, I, I seriously like. I do not understand why these games are so popular and make so much money. I like. I feel like I, people I, get I, the I, idea of like it's free, and then they're like, I won't spend any money, and then they'll spend money like once, and then they'll just never yeah, stop the, spending there's money. There's other things that like people are, like praising the game's story and like the amount of content it has. Like people like actually like really enjoy these games like, genuinely, and I really? just can't, I just can't see it like. Every time I watch someone play something like this, the story is shit. The voice acting is terrible, in English at least. I haven't seen Japanese, but like... The gameplay, like, auto-plays itself. There's literally an auto-play button, you know? Is there really? Like, yeah, it's just, it's just like, I, I don't know, man. I just don't see it. I just don't see how these games get so popular. I really don't. Uh, that's so I just, I, I just think, I think everything... I know, I mean, like, a lot of people play Genshin and a lot of people play Star Rail. Like, one of the most biggest money-making machines. Some people play both. <laughs> yeah, like, one of the most crazy money-making machines. I just do not see it. I cannot see any appeal with those games. I really can't. We have news to share with you on its release with this brand new trailer. What's this? Most hardcore Sonic fans I know are either massive furry perverts or two brain cells away from needing a helmet to walk outside. <laughs> Holy shit. Damn, I went crazy on the Sonic fans. What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, don't do the Sonic fans like that, man. Oh, wait, I got another one, right? Oh, wait, I didn't put that in the bingo, did I? Oh no, because he said there was a demo. That's right. Oh, this is that Lies of P game. Is it? Did this game looks really, really cool. What the fuck it's is like it? A, it's a Dark Souls game, but it's set in the Pinocchio universe. The story is actually Pinocchio. What? Yeah. I think it's kind of cool. I think it's a cool idea. The Pinocchio uni- What the fuck is the Pinocchio universe? <laughs> <That's> just... <laughs> Dude, I watched Pinocchio as a kid. <laughs> like, this I'm is not the Pinocchio universe. <laughs> I'm t look it up, dude. I'm telling you, it's a real thing. The game is, is is Pinocchio. It's why it's lies of P. Pinocchio. Dude, where's the where's the island where all the kids, all the boys, turn into donkeys? Where's the whale? It's an adaptation of it, obviously. The guy who builds machines is building a bunch of crazy fucking fucked up machines. It's like Alice what, in Wonderland. Papa Geppetto. Dude, you know? Papa Geppetto. He would never do this. Papa Geppetto built all these crazy like contraptions, dude. He did not. He would not do this. He, he only did. builds nice. He only he builds did. nice little boys. And he builds Look how good little boys. He just want to be a real umbrella. boy. <laughs> There's the whale. Oh. Was that the whale? Wait, is that is that Pinocchio? That's not Pinocchio. Listen, pal. Nice landing, but uh, let's not make it. It is that. Pinocchio. Look it up, dude. It's Pinocchio. I'm that telling you, it's Pinocchio. Pinocchio. I'm that telling you, my... it is Pinocchio. Hash hashtag. Pinocchio. Hashtag not my Pinocchio. Hashtag not my Pinocchio. <laughs> I'm telling you, dude. That's right. A demo for Lies of P is now available across PlayStation, Xbox, oh! and PC. Check it out. Oh wait, I can, dude. I can play this. Oh, when I come that's back. why I've seen it. That's why. That, that's what now I must have seen. It's oh, like dude, I have to play the demo, guys. I gotta play the demo. New game based on Played off this. Manga with a story <laughs> I gotta download it. One of the most celebrated anime artists of all time. This is one of those games that I feel lucky anime? to reveal. For the first time here at Summer Game Fest. And yeah, but anime doesn't automatically mean bad. It, it automatically means bad if it's anime gotcha. Is this One Piece? <laughs> 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 this is the one anime you've watched. Oh, this is. Wait, this could be um, uh, Tails. Oh, game. it's Naruto. No, no, it's Tails. Oh, wait, it's not what? Tails, actually. There's a car. Is this Dragon Ball? I think it is Dragon Ball. I think you're right. Is it a new Dragon, Dragon Ball. Ball game? Yeah. It looks very Dragon Ball to me. I'm dragging my ball along your face. Yep. From the creator of Dragon Ball. Oh, wait. It, it isn't Dragon Ball, but it's from the creator of Dragon Ball. Oh, that's cool. Huh. Wait, this American actually looks kind of fun. 
Oh, whoa. Very Wait, cool. I, dude, I love the art style of this, actually. Yeah, it's super cool. Yo, Zone, what's up? Oh, look at that big ass scorpion. You know what it kind of reminds me of? It kind of reminds me of Borderlands, actually. Uh, that's this. kind of what I was yeah, thinking. Like, uh, Borderlands and there's something else I was thinking. Fuck, I don't know. Lost packing. It. Nice. Pog. Exciting. Packing what? Packing my nuts. A massive schlong. Um, <laughs> uh, is, wait, isn't there already a game called Small Land? Oh, this is called Sandland. Never mind. Okay. <laughs> yeah, Dragon Quest. True. That that isn't what I was thinking, but yeah. It does look a lot like Dragon Quest. Quest. Yeah, you're right. To become an unlikely hero in an adventure where you don't need to be human to save humanity. Uh, that's coming from Bandai Namco, and we're excited to see more of it soon. That's pretty cool. Independent games are such an important part of Elden the Ring. industry. And one thing that's very important to us at Summer Game Fest is supporting those creators as well. After the live sh show, stay tuned for Day of the Devs from I'm 8-Bit and Double Fine with some incredible indie Ooh, game reviews. Ooh, yeah, we're going to watch the indie now, game the show, dude. I love indie games. Publishers is sure. Interactive. Double Fine's Later pretty good, aren't they? Nah, Silk Song, Silk Song has got to be in the main show, dude. We're, we're going to see it soon, projects. very soon, guys. Let's see how many you can Silk Song wouldn't be classed as an indie game anymore, would it? Like... Nah, 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 nah. It's a big shot triple A. I guess it's not triple A, is it? But yeah, uh, sure. Oh, <gasps> Out of Wilds. I just saw Out of Wilds for a second. This is, I think this is a trailer for the indie showcase. What the? Oh, this oh is, what's that, that game cool called? Card game shooter thing. Yeah, that looks super cool, that one. I've never played it, but that's so cool. Out of Wilds! Oh. Oh, Annapurna. Oh, Hyperlight Drifter. That's right. Didn't they make that into like a, some weird open world roguelike thing? I wonder what that was at the end. We'll find out later this month. All right. Next, we're stepping into the world of Throne and Liberty, a free to play PC and console MMORPG oh, from God. Ubisoft and Amazon. Is it sequel to something? Always changing environment. Is it sequel? Massive scale. No, it's TV, it's just a shit MMO, probably. NC Soft, isn't that who made uh, Guild Wars? That's who published Guild Wars, yeah. Publish, uh. They didn't make it though. Arena Net made Guild Wars. Uh, Arena Net, that's right. The problem, like, okay, NC Soft, sure, but Amazon Games, dude. Remember Amazon Amazon Games' track record is literally like nothing. New World? <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> yeah, okay, dude. I New sunk world. some hours into that. Uh, chopping wood, wood chopping simulator. Actually, fun though, dude. Don't even. Uh, you didn't okay, even play dude. it. Come on now. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. It was not a bad game. It wasn't a good game, but it wasn't a bad game. It almost makes it worse. It's not as funny. It's just boring. This is going to be trash. I'm so... You just think I'm, anything that isn't Guild Wars and it's an MMO I, is just trash. Yeah, because it literally always is recently. Think of a recent MMO that's actually been good. Give me one. And don't say New World. Have there been any? Have there been any? There's been quite like a few, yeah. BDO, well, I, I, BDO came out. They they remade they BDO. Years ago. They, 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 they came, came out they, ages ago. Dude, they they brought it out twice. They they made another version of BDO. Oh, a and the reason, and the, by the way, the reason they never come out is because they never get fucking finished. That's they're always true. stuck in development hell. Yeah, yeah, true. I feel like they every get gets started announced. going, and then they <laughs> they get announced every year, and they never come out. True. That's very true. This looks way too like like way too good to actually be a thing. Am I crazy? Yeah, no, I'm just you gotta be I'm super cynical when it comes to MMOs. There's no way. There's just no way. It will not be this fun. No. Nah. Wasn't that the trash demo you played a while ago? No, that was Raven Raven Bound. <laughs> oh, that was terrible. That game was really bad. Yeah, like oh my god. Guild Wars was good. Yeah, I loved Guild Wars too. I never played the third expansion though. Looks great. I also want to say <laughs> even to Jeff didn't look impressed. <laughs> Looks great. <laughs> well, yeah, I was looking at the chat. I didn't see his face. <laughs> this is like deadpan, just like, Looks great. <laughs> Introducing Nick Cage to talk about the new MMO. Hey, gamers, it's me again. <laughs> he just comes back for every announcement. Walks on and off stage.
Is this the same thing? Is why it is it shivery? muted? Yeah, why is it? Oh, uh, is it because it copyrighted music? Ah, uh, probably, yeah. Uh, ah, cringe. cringe. Next on, that's, yeah, wait, this could be chivalry, maybe. No, maybe tell. not, there's magic. Oh, no, there's magic. No, 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 it's, it's not, it's not. What was is it this? Baldur's Gate 3? <laughs> what the fuck wait, is, is this? Oh, oh, wait. Wait, it looks like... Is it multiplayer? What is this? Yeah, it looks multiplayer. Are they versing other no, people they, they or are look they, like, AI? they look like NPCs. This looks like some kind of Dynasty Warriors ripoff. Yeah, ripoff. yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe. I don't know. I wish there was what sound, the but. Magic? All right. Okay. It could be kind of like a cool co op thing, maybe. Well, I don't really know. I can't tell if it's PvP yeah. or co op or both. I think like, it's just. It... I think it's just co op. I think it's. I think you're right. I think it's just NPCs, then it's just like co op. Is it PvPvE, though? Like, is it like, P oh, like could some, be. some some of them could are players be, yeah. and, and then some of them are... It's yeah, kind of like... Right. There's like teams, teams of like four or five or something. That's what For Honor did. For Honor had like NPCs and then... And I then feel like that that, that could have been a big game as well, For Honor, but it's kind of died, didn't it? I don't know. They look so much like Elden Ring characters, Dark Souls. Or Haven. Okay. Play for free. Maybe you're right. Like, Maybe it is PvP. I think you're right. I think it's PvPvE. Is that Jack Septica? <gasps> oh, guys, guys, streamers! <gasps> I love streamers. This, what's this gang beast or whatever? Yeah, yeah. Is this any good? This game? I've never played it. I don't know. I feel like it'd probably be good for like one time. Oh, party times. animals. Oh, what's that? Animal party? That's close. What's that? Wait, I thought that was already out. Dude, I, feel like that, I thought that was out for years. Like Gang Beast without the bugs. <laughs> okay. Pilgrims, summer is coming, and with it, a lot of cool stuff will make its way to dying lights to stay human. Get ready for darker, Whoa, more dangerous dude, are we ever going to play this? Rolling out no. The next update in June. Okay. Unless it goes on sale for like 10 bucks. Hey. Like you have never seen before. It probably Trust will at some point eventually. I feel like this is definitely a bargain wire. bin game a couple of few years down the track from now. DLC was not good, by the way, though. <laughs> yeah. When we play. <laughs> is that Crash Bandicoot? What? Wait. Mine just froze. Mine just froze too. What it's the? freezing again. Okay. <laughs> no, the, why do they have to freeze on Crash Bandicoot, dude? No. New maps, new pals. Is there a Crash Bandicoot game out? What is this? Get the Wampers? Did I get the get Wampers? <laughs> Any Wampa enjoys? Oh, Crash Team Rumble. Okay. Cool. Oh, Psychonauts too. What? Nah, it's just oh, an no. ad for the. It's just an ad for the Samsung Gaming Hub. Play with the game game. <laughs> hey, the kangaroo. You played the the demo? Yeah, I did. No, no console. console. Oh. oh, is this is this like Samsung's version of like the Google thing that flopped? Stadia or whatever is that what it was? Yeah, yeah. It's like everything's cloud. It's all in the cloud. Samsung Gaming Hub. Okay, I'm not super impressed so far. Gonna be honest, guys. Yeah, it's a pretty fucking resident sleeper. What do you guys think? Playable Ripper Roo and Engine. Neil Cortex's right hand guy in season one. Now it's time to change the topic. Season one. Like there's gonna be more than one. Joining me Shut the, the fuck up. Season one. To announce Alan Wake 2. He's come all the way from Finland. Please welcome from Red I remember I got Sam Lane. I got Alan Wake 1 for one of my birthday presents on 360. And like I got like I like the full collector's edition with like a little statue and shit. <laughs> I played it for like two hours and I was like, this is shit. Well, we are so excited because I just remember you have a fucking flashlight and that's like all you had. And I was just like, this is trash. Yeah, you, you, you gotta use the flashlight to, to get rid of the so monsters, dude, because otherwise it's scary. Time coming for fans and for you. It's fucking trash. Oh, man. Quite a journey, yes. Yeah. Um, Alan is that Wake Alan Wake? Oh no, it's <gasps> Sam Lake. <laughs> we have two playable characters. It's a 50 split between them. They are on their own separate terrifying journeys 
through two different worlds, and yet it's all connected. Sonic and Prince of Persia looked interesting. Yeah, actually, Sonic was pretty cool. Sonic, Sonic yeah, Sonic looked cool. Uh, Prince of Persia, it's like, I don't care because I've never played it. So I feel like uh, that has a chance of going either way. I don't know. It could be really good or really bad. I'm sure it'll be a good game. I'm sure people who like Prince of Persia will play it and like it, mm. but... I don't know. Well, Didn't uh, they just release a remake slash master for the oh, first game? I think so. <laughs> or they do it, or they releasing Wake, it? I don't know. I can't remember. Of course, and maybe they did release it. The yes. of the dark place. Yeah. And then we have. I think Saga, he's. I think you're right. Uh, uh, hero, I feel like FBI I've seen agent, something a little while ago about uh, it. Coming to the Pacific Northwest small town of oh. Falls, oh, Jesus. With her partner, <laughs> what do you have? Already, a bingo card again? Already yawning. Uh, yeah. It's this is, uh, remake of Nobody Asked For Game, Silk Song, uh, Generic Survival Game, Elden Ring DLC, and Farming Simulator. We've only got one so far, which is Gacha Weave Trash Game. And, and very quickly, we, gotta, we, still gotta, we still got a while to go, though. Okay. Like, that's, and, well, we like, have the indie shows halfway. as well. The indie, sh the, dude, the indie shows will definitely have a farming farming one, for uh, sure. Maybe True. Every single it's indie show has, like, at least... 11 uh, fucking Animal Crossing <laughs> clones. <laughs> so that'll be an easy tick. And Silk Song's on the way, so... Silk Song's all but guaranteed in this show. I mean, they, they have... They, they have to... Uh, they have to... Bring the big guns at some point, you know? Like, the show's been, been pretty mid up until this point. The show's been pretty mid up until this point. So, they're obviously... <laughs> Fuck up! I'm not on copium. <laughs> They're bringing uh, out the big guns soon, and it'll be Hollow Knight. Experience. We are not expecting everybody to do homework okay. if, if they have not played the original. They'll game. end in big uh, announcements. Exactly. Uh, Silk Song being one of those big announcements. Does anyone care about Silk Song? Yeah, what did I just hear out of your bitch ass mouth, dude? <laughs> what did I just hear out of your <laughs> bitch ass mouth, dude? Uh, we'll be on, on that journey with, with Holy and, and, uh, better, you better experience. watch your tone. What the fuck is that? You watch your tone, to boy. Alan Wake in the dark place, uh, as he's trying to Too easy. Out, and you can keep on playing. Does the, pista does the pistachio the thing fit as Elden Ring thing? Nah. Nah, nah. But I was gonna put it on the the bingo card. Hey, this guy is waffling, dude. Get off the fucking stage, man. No one cares. And I love watching. I'm sure he's not supposed to have this. I'm sure he's not supposed to have this much time. <laughs> you think Jeff's just like? You think Jeff's trying to communicate him to get the fuck yeah. off the stage? Yeah, I feel like he's without trying to tell him, like, shut the fuck up. He's like staring at him. Oh man. I said I like to imagine that you just be like in the front row today, though, of this show you, know, with you, you know some yeah. just like move the fuck on no one cares <laughs> oh my god resident <laughs> sleeper from the experience they're hyped Sam. they're ready for it they're just clapping to get him off the stage show the gameplay no one gets about yeah <laughs> supernatural forces of darkness have uh the suit the, the supernatural victim, forces uh, of darkness. Case, Google translated that to policies. And, and supernatural uh, policies of darkness. Outside Pride Falls at Cauldron Lake, trying to oh my God. find him and stop him. Okay, with that, let's take a look at raw. <laughs> okay, finally. Gameplay from Alan Wake Two. Oh, dude, XM. raw, dude. Sam Lake's giving us some raw, raw dog in us. <laughs> He's raw dog us with gameplay, dude. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Wait, who's that? Is that Helen Wake? <laughs> Mrs. Wake. <laughs> Mrs. Wake. <laughs> uh... yeah, it does look kind of Resident Evil-y. I'm sure it takes inspiration from that sort of, yeah, like from Resident Evil and stuff like that. Sounds like somebody's home. It's poopy. The thing about Resident Evil, though, is that when it's not being scary, it's being funny. Whereas I don't see this game being funny. Nah, it probably so takes it, itself too serious. Yeah, so it better be scary. Because if it's not that, then it's got nothing to fall back on. Resident Evil's got something to fall back on. All games look like this nowadays? Yeah, pro that's probably true. That's, that's pretty true. That's pretty true. 
looks like a crime show. Why? Because she's wearing an FBI jacket. Yeah, I was going to say the same thing. <laughs> did that deer get you? Did, any, did you get scared no. by the deer? No? Me neither. Oh, jeez, that kind of got me, though. Fuck me. Uh, I'll admit that got me. <laughs> I yumped. <laughs> did you yump? I yumped. Actually? You yumped? A little bit. I, uh, I yumped, yumped a little, little bit. bit. Okay. It's really deep, it's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Why, why didn't you shoot him in the head the first time? Ant look guy breaking through the deer sign, subtle. <laughs> <laughs> True. We're the deer boys. We come from Ireland. <laughs> oh, she's gonna get a a, a fucking a rifle. Oh, no. whoa! Look at that cool special effect, dude. Oh my god, the heart. Tattooed heart. <laughs> what? Got live, laugh, live, live, laugh, love on there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, why are the gameplay trailers like so short and bad? Like, I don't get it. Killer left a message. I feel like, yeah, like most game trailers nowadays, they just refuse to show actual gameplay. Like, just like do a I feel raw like the game, gameplay the, footage. The, yeah, the gameplay reveals of the old days were like, dude, you remember the like, dude, the Assassin's Creed three reveal from way back when? It was like twenty minutes long. Yeah. Hey, you don't now see that shit anymore, really. Yeah, now there's like two minutes. You know they say raw gameplay, it's like barely anything. If, I, if I'm if i gonna get it raw, I wanna get it deep. I wanna get it long, okay? I don't want this... Long dick stuff. I don't wanna get this short. Oh, yes! That's cool. Yes! Oh my god, fuck yes, finally. I literally just went on like a spree of watching Cherry finally breaks Warhammer 40k videos on YouTube. Have a look at this new Silk Song trailer. My name is Jeff Keithley. Oh man, if only. Dude, this is. Oh yes, dude. No, Captain. Dude, the first game was so fucking good, man. I, uh, you've spoken about that game multiple times. Oh, bro. If you haven't played that game, you got to go back and play that game, dude. Yeah, pretty good. Oh, oh it's, it, dude, it holds up. Although it kind of, it sounds like it has a big crashing problem on PC, but apart from that. Oh my God! Look at how many fucking. Oh. Damn. Look at all, look at all the tyrannids, dude. Oh. Oh. This looks fucking so cool. That's really good. Damn. Wait, co op <gasps> campaign. Three player co op. Up to three player. Oh. Perfect. Oh, dude. So good. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Look at them just like flooding in. That's, That's so, so cool. cool. Oh, my God. Okay. Dude, Actually, I'm my best. computer. I'd be able to run it, though. <laughs> Actually, best trailer of this show. No Wait, joke. Oh, it's on PC. That was cool. Actually, best trailer of this show so far, in my opinion. Mm. Or best announcement, at least. Pixel graphics. Very original. Oh, is this the sequel to that to that uh, to that um, Kingdom Kingdom Two Crowns game? What? Is this a nobody asked for sequel? No, I think people actually ask for this one. Okay. This is a this is a legit game franchise. I'm pretty sure. If it's if it's what I'm thinking, it is. I'm not actually sure if it is or not. Or oh, you can be a king. Yeah, I think it is. I think it's the sequel to uh, Kingdom Two Crowns. Okay, I might play this. It's kind of looks like it could be pretty cool. Hmm. 
Yes, your grace. No oh, call. it's not that. Oh, okay. Potatoes. Game. Yes, your grace. Snowfall. Now it is time for another. Yes, your grace. This one comes from the minds of Saber Interactive, Focus Entertainment, and yes, Horror Master John Carpenter. It's a brand new world, a Oops. brand new story. John Most Carpenter, like, you know? John? You know John Video Game? This is like. Oh, the, John Video Game. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is like the the Carpenter version. He's a Carpenter. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. He does all the carpenting. It's his brother. If anything's ever been carpented, he did it. John Carpenter did it, yeah, right. Yeah. You gotta be ready. Wait, is this that stupid game that isn't actually real? What? There's some game that, like, was announced that... It's called The no, Day Before, I think. Nah, I think this is that. It's not that scam nah. game? Okay. Nah, I don't think it's that. Because that wasn't, like, action metal music sort of thing. Oh, yeah, true. I don't think... Oh wait, is it is it um oh I think I know what this is. I think I know what this is actually. It's a sequel. Is it? What is this? It's um oh dude, there was a trailer that came out for it ages ago. Oh never mind. No, it's not that. Zombies. There's a lot of zombies though. It looks like it could be cool. Lots doesn't mean good. That's true. This looks like it could go either way. It looks like it's going at 30 fucking frames, if that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, wait, now that you pointed out. <laughs> oh my god. So <laughs> it is running like shit on the trailer, you're right. <laughs> no, man, like, zombies is just so overplayed, like. I don't know. I think you can, you can get it right. You can even do a good zombie e game, even but I today. feel like. I feel like. I don't know. I think everyone's trying to like get on the Left 4 Dead train, you know. But just none of them has, have been like as good as the original Left 4 Dead. Didn't that Left 4 Dead like remake or whatever? What was it called? Back, Back for Blood. Blood? Like, no one played that. Yeah, I, we played the demo to that, didn't we? I think, and it was terrible. <laughs> zombies peaked at Plants vs Zombies. Good take. Today. <gasps> A new member is joining the cast. We're about to see the reveal oh, of Lord dude. Ember Gortash, the commander of a mechanical dude. army of Steel Watchers. He's a second Listening. antagonist and is voiced by a familiar name. Everyone shut up. Ember Gortash, swearest thou by Baldurin's blade to defend the citizens of Baldur's Gate from enemies within and without Oh, sorry, I can't help but moan, dude. People of Baldur's Gate granting me complete power over them. A new age is upon us. Don't show oh, the fucking voice acting, dude. Oh wait, it's Jonathan Isaacs. Okay, you can show that. A dog understands the yoke of the leash and the hand of its master, but it cannot be an equal. You can be my equal. There's an old wisdom: a brittle alliance can never be mended. Ooh, not so sure about that lip syncing, I'll be honest. Ooh, I hope they work on that. That's uh it's not looking great. Is this Fortnite creative? <laughs> Baldur's Gate dude. Oh, I'm so excited. So excited. When does 1.0 come out again? September? Didn't he get pushed? August 31st! Oh! Oh! oh. Oh my god. It isn't you I answer. Dude, I, oh my god. Gortash. Yes, dude. Your lad, how's it going, man? Damn. Is on track. How's your stream, bro? Still for the end of August, and we can't wait to check that out. All right. This fall, Marvel Games and Insomniac are set to bring Spider Man 2 exclusively to PlayStation. This guy woke out too early. Sounds like you guys are a little hyped to tell us more. I think so. This guy, he walked out too early. He's like, I'm going out. Fuck you guys. <laughs> I know you guys are deep in development. First Didn't even all, announce like him. We have some uh, fancy art behind us. This, yeah. You don't want to spoil You just finished this? Uh, okay. okay. You know, uh, sorry we couldn't watch it together, dude. I mean, 
has two on the box. We'll get them next time. Because yeah. this game features two Spider-Men, so we're really excited about it. Two Spider-Men, uh, wow. Miles, uh, we're so excited about this, um, you know, experience. I think you can, I think, um, characters, you can, uh, like, uh, switch between, because I, I didn't I care about spoils for Spider-Man because they already announced it. Villains, I think, in the game. Uh, at the so PlayStation show, but I'm pretty sure you can, like, switch between the two characters, like GTA. Remember GTA Five, Where you could, like, dynamically switch? Yeah, I think you can do that with this game. I'm pretty sure. That's cool. Because of what, it's Miles and um, Peter. It's Miles and Peter, yeah. You can play as both of them. That's cool. And I think, I think, I don't think it's, like, it, it may be, like, contextual, like, you may only be able to play one at a time or whatever, but I don't think it is. I think, at least in the open world, you can, like... Play whoever Marvel you want. Characters that live in New York City. So Peter Miles. Why are the barbarians? He's on the hunt. And there's like a character that's like a there's like a character but, that's that Venom also is like that. Uh, you know, I forget yeah, okay. I forget his name. There's like some some Spider-Man villain that's. Oh like, Venom! Oh, he looks oh. sick. Oh. oh. I'm glad you're happy. I'm glad I don't know how much you're gonna. Dude, imagine you could play that. Is this, uh, imagine if you could play as Venom. That'd be nuts. Venom? Can you tell us what's the origin of uh, Eddie Brock Venom? Or? It is not Eddie Brock. Okay. It is not. Oh. Is not Eddie Brock. Okay. Um, our goal was to tell different a Venom story, something yeah. you original seen in the comics, the movies. Yeah, obviously. Wow. We love. Wait, Venom is it, is it going to be a brand new character that takes on Venom? About the character going to be there. That's cool. How the story plays out. There's been like several Venom. Venoms in the comics. Play the game and see how it goes. Really? Yeah. Wow. Okay. But Eddie Brock's like the main the one. Now, yep. obviously the, the that's too bad. It's kind of too bad it's not Eddie Brock actually, because Eddie Brock was is kind of a cool. I feel like he's a classic, isn't he? He's like a staple of the. He's a really yeah. He's a really he's actually a really really good character. Like a really at least in the comics, yeah. like super interesting. They didn't do him justice in the in the movies. I don't think. Yeah, I mean, I think you. Like I think the third Spider-Man movie and also yeah, he was a bit of a bitch and like just like a, a douchebag for sure. Yeah, and then and then the Venom movies, he was like he was like terrible. I did not like the Venom yeah. movie. I was laughing through that. Yeah, it's, really too, it's too bad they didn't do Eddie Brock. They haven't done Ooh. really any Brock, Eddie Brock Wait, any you justice. Be, you can be Venom Spider-Man, though. Yeah, you can, which makes me think, like, what if you can play as Venom, you know? Maybe. Maybe they're going to, like, wait to reveal that. That would be sick. That would be cool if you got to be Venom and just, like, demolish people. <laughs> just eat them, dude. <laughs> yeah, like, chomp their heads off. Fuck, that would be cool. I'd love to see like an actual Venom game, where it's oh, just like you like it's like a Venom story, yeah. and you're yeah, just like brutal. Cool. It's like a horror style like Spider-Man game. Like Omni Insomniac has done some mature games before, not many, but they're they are capable of doing it. Like, that'd be pretty. It'd be sick. super cool to see something like that. It'd be kind of cool, like, like be... nightmarish character. It'd be like Prototype. Remember the old Prototype? Games? Yeah, I do. I love Prototype, the first one. I played the shit out of that. Gonna make it this fall. It's cool Craven the Hunter. You know, oh, that's right. His no name's Craven. Yeah. Yes. Craven, my boy. Promise you. Craven's Craven some nuts in his mouth. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, what did he say? Oh, it's your gameplay. Nice. Venom gameplay. We like that. I th okay, the show's picking up now. We've got Space Marine, Space Marine Two. We got uh, Baldur's Gate stuff. October twenty. October. Wow. Holy wow, shit, dude, wait, this is, a, this is a mad year, though. A Baldur's Gate in August? Spider-Man 2 in October? Awesome. Well, Brian, Damn. Did they have a release date for Space Marine 2, or was that just an announcement? Like a gameplay thing. I can't remember. I can't remember now. I don't think there was a date. That's pretty early, I think, that game. Yeah. It's only announced it, like, last year, didn't <laughs> Yes! <laughs> Another one for the bingo, boys. What? Open, open world survival game. Oh, let's go. Oh, wait, is it generic, though? If it's generic, we can we can cross it off. Depends how generic oh, it is. That, he said Pokemon with guns. This is that game that got announced, like... like is this that game that got announced, like, a little while ago? Oh, this... This is, like, the Pokemon hardcore ripoff. I remember we watched this, Power World. We watched something about this, didn't we? Wait, is this like the one where you like it. they whip out the guns or something? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this game looks so stupid, man. Wait, how are they? How are they not getting like fucking taken <laughs> down for this? Am I crazy? <laughs> Look at I feel shit. like Pokemon. I feel like Pokemon like does not would not allow this. Am I crazy? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I mean, Temtem came out, but at least the things in Temtem were like original. Like these are just straight up rips, like. They're literally just ripoffs. Like you can see the likeness in so many. How does a ripoff like this like get a main stage appearance? That's the thing. It's like I understand them getting away with releasing the game, sure, but like this is the Summer Games Fest, dude. 
Like, there are legit games on here. <laughs> some games, some guys like, yeah! <laughs> yeah, like, they're not even trying to hide it. It's... Did that count as generic? Like, I'm, I'm gonna count that as generic nah. just because it was a Pokemon nah, it's copy, not, It's not a generic survival, though. When I think of generic survival, it's like you go around cutting down a tree. Yeah, like, you know okay. What I mean? Yeah, you're probably right. I was That's just not generic. Take one off the bingo, you know? Yeah, but you can't... You gotta be... You gotta be, you know, strict with it. I know, I know. We've never won bingo. Otherwise, it ever. means nothing. What is this? Oh, wait, is this that um, Neo from the guys who made Neo? Oh, wait, it might it not looks be. like Neo. No, I it's think like it's... similar um, to Neo. No, it's not, it's not, it's not. That one already came out. I forgot about that. That game already released. <laughs> I actually just forgot. <laughs> Feels that good. It does look cool, though. It looks... It looks like BDO kind of combat, which, mm. yeah, whatever. Land of Land? the Morning Light. Ooh. Oh, it is Black Desert. Black Desert, okay. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Our story is more than what hobbits Ooh. elves know. Lord of the this? Rings? <gasps> yeah. Wait, is this like a dwarf? Lo oh. Wow, that's cool. Is this like, Wait. Is this like Lord of the Rings uh, fucking Across rock and stone? Oh! Yet the greatest treasure remains wait, it look, wait, there's so many dwarves though. It looks like a town builder. Will Gollum be in it? <laughs> wait, oh, is it? Oh, wait, maybe it's like, um... Dungeon? Dungeon Defenders or whatever? Like Dungeon Master or whatever it is. No, what's it called? No, um... What is this? You reckon it's like Deep Rock? Nah, no, I don't think it is. I think you're right. I think it's like some sort of like town builder thing, like dungeon builder or whatever. I can't tell. It's called? I couldn't tell what the genre out. was from that trailer. Yeah, it's hard. It's hard. Okay, wait, Ad. I'm going to check the bingo card if we have anything. Remake of a game nobody asked for. We still haven't gotten anything, dude. Silk Song's going to happen. It's going to happen, guys. It's going to happen. It's going to happen, dude. We got plenty yeah, of show left. I thought that'd be Elden Ring DLC. I thought that'd be Elden Ring DLC. We, we still got time. We got plenty of show left. Cause that came out like a, almost a year ago now. The announcement for it. When did Elden the, Ring or, come or out? Or the game? The game came out early last year, I think. If I remember correctly. All right, now we're gonna look at an. In a February 2022, yeah. From what I saw of it, it, feels like Deep Rock, but Lord of the Rings. Okay. Okay. Plenty of show left, dude. There is. Oh, it's Final Fantasy. The only Final oh, Fantasy. Oh, how did we not was... have that on there? We should have put Final Fantasy on there. Uh, I don't know. I, oh, yeah, I guess because 16's coming out as well. Yeah. It would have been a pretty safe bet considering there's two big Final Fantasy games coming out pretty soon. Or, like on the. There's a remake or something of one of the old ones. Yeah, because the the old PS1 one got like, I think it got a, it's it's like a remake, but it's like a, kind of like a rejig. I think the story's supposed to be a lot bigger or different or something and they're making like multiple uh. games out of it did anyone play the what is it final fantasy 6 or whatever the remake that they released or 7 whichever one it was on PS5 I, didn't play or? It. I didn't play it but maybe it was pretty popular i'm sure someone played it <laughs> i'm sure someone played it. i mean someone in the someone in the chat probably did anyone, did anyone play it i've never played final fantasy some of them are okay. I don't. I don't mind. Mind a few of them. I'm looking forward to number number sixteen actually, because sixteen has like full action combat, like no turn based stuff. I don't mind turn based. I just don't like the JRPG kind of turn based. I, it doesn't really appeal to me. Ah, oh, Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're like splitting it into. Wait for iOS and Android. Fuck. What? Pre-registration for Final Fantasy what? Crisis has just started, huh? and users will have the chance to participate in an upcoming closed beta. They're still releasing it in parts. Now, is that one of the parts? Because it said it was iOS and Android only. No, 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 no. Today during Summer Game Fest, DoorDash has your back. Get <laughs> you can get a free burrito uh, when you order from Taco Bell using the code GameFest. Plus, get good the one, Jeff. To win a Final Fantasy 16 prize pack. DoorDash, Ooh. stay in your game. Yep, we got you. What do you reckon the prize pack now, doesn't come with the game? game we last year at TGA. 
No idea. I was, I, I'm not that, I'm not that boss. I couldn't think of anything. Sorry. <laughs> I let you down. Come on, dude. Where's the wit? Where's the comeback? What I'll I put this make on a vape just then. What am I paying you for? Huh? To the living. You're not. <laughs> I'm paying you an exposure. <laughs> What's this? This looks kind of cool. Okay. Yeah. Oh, oh. We bring closure to those who don't. Okay. Ooh, okay. It looks, uh, I don't know. It looks fine, I guess. Wait, it could be cool. Is it co-op? I'm confused. Is it, do you play as the guy and the girl, or do you switch between? Oh, it looks like you switch between them. You make choices. Your choices matter, dude. Oh, shit. Dude, your choices always... They always affect the game change world. change the story. <laughs> what you do will shape the world. <laughs> Every choice matters. Come out, wherever you are. Come on, show yourself. Red. He's Scottish. Hey, you wee cunt, come out the fucking <laughs> shadows. <laughs> <laughs> Banishers. Ghost Banishers. Of okay. Ghosts of New Eden. <laughs> what? Yakuza. Oh, just, yeah, Yakuza. I actually want to play these games. I feel like they're just so stupid fun. Like, I played Yakuza 0. That was pretty fun. You hate choices. <laughs> I don't play video games to make choices. Take them for me. This looks like the main guy. This looks like what's his name? Ki Kiru or whatever. I thought the new one was like a western, like it's like an old school one. Yeah, that already came out though. Did it? Yeah, oh. that, that already released, dude. <laughs> dude. How many have they released in the last like year oh, or two? I thought like they released like Fox three times. or something. It's a spin-off. This is another one. I mean, I'm assuming they're reusing a lot of assets, right? Like. Yeah, true. I guess it's a lot of like, uh, like, roller shit, isn't it? Yeah, I know one of the more recent ones was turn-based. That was the like a. Oh yeah, it was one. too. Yeah, that's right. It was too. Yeah. Oh shit, it's whoever that guy is. Yeah, was that supposed to be a big reveal of like someone in the game? I don't know. No, I think that's just how they do the camera <laughs> camera work in these kind of uh, games. I feel like I, I thought it was supposed to be like a celebrity or something, like some Like a Dragon Gaiden. The man who erased his name. Oh shit. Okay. Pretty cool. Good morning, Stanley. It is seven thirty. Generic survival game? If it's copying Subnautica, I'm calling it generic. I don't care. Change username to just Stan. Okay, this is like a story game actually. Good morning, just Stan. Base to Castle 12, come in. You there, Stan? Green across the board. Looks like we're good. Okay, it's not. I don't think it's a Subnautica copy. Nah, definitely not. Definitely a leak here, Tim. It was like a slice of life story game. Kind of reminded me like a. You remember the movie Oblivion? No. Anybody ever see the movie Oblivion? How long is it no. Now? Shut the- I wasn't asking you, bitch. You're the only person who watched it. <laughs> the actual clown. Yeah, look, yeah, it looks, it looks kind of cool. I, I'm a bit- yeah, I'm a bit- nice. I got a bit I'd of a water fear this. ever since I- ever since I played Subnautica, I- I'm kind of like a bit- a bit shifty about water. I'll be honest. Is it going to be some like psychological horror type thing? That'd be yeah, sick. it seems like it. Under the waves. Okay, that's interesting. August? Pretty cool. I'll keep that on the radar. He went down there to escape his past. He doesn't want to remember it. His daughter died. <laughs> it literally went up. Oh, dude, okay, I'm gonna hear the toilet while this is on because I don't care. I'll be back. Uh, okay.
Here's your first look at Vondel, a new Warzone location with points. Warzone 2. I've still never played stadium, Warzone ever. My pants zoo. are falling down, bro. Yep. It's all <laughs> happening. Check it out. Pull them up. Here you go. Whoa, look sick. You reckon there's gonna be rap in the trailer? What's the bet? There it is. <laughs> Classic, dude. It's a, it, that's a pretty cool looking map, though. I'll give it that. That's actually pretty sick. I like the height. I wish the 2042 maps looked this cool. Yeah, I don't know. I'm still not going to be down to, to download the... To download the 500 gigs or whatever that this game takes, six million <laughs> gigs. Is this like uh, is this an update to the battle royale? Yeah. Nice. I was just saying the map actually looks kind of cool. I'll give it that. The map looks pretty interesting. There's a lot of like height to it, you know. Verticality. Verticality, yeah. Okay. Very cool. Where's Silk Song? Week. Today is a big day for video Silk Song games, next week. A huge day for Porsche, the iconic German automaker oh turned 75 oh years old today. Oh my god, did you show the video games, games bro? A 911 in some point at a game. Xbox has teamed up with Porsche for a limited edition run <laughs> of 75 up. consoles inspired by six <laughs> famous Porsche race cars. And I'm thrilled to debut the first design here today inspired by the Porsche 963 that's racing this weekend at the 100th running of the 24 hours of Le Mans. Wow. Race Why do they advertise Porsches to gamers? <laughs> like you never who? know. Some, some of them might be rich gamers. They probably just picked up the new Apple VR yeah, but headset. Like, I, feel like, I feel like if they if they have money, like they're either going to have a Porsche or they're not because they, they either like Porsche or they... I don't know, man. This feels weird. Advertising just works, dude. Otherwise, they wouldn't do it, you know? I guess. Think about it. You ad If you advertise... Th think about it this way, right? Let's say a bunch of kids watch this, right? And, they, and they're like, Oh my god, Porsche. Porsche looks so cool. And they and then they go up and they're like... Here it is. They end up um, being mega oh, millionaires well, or yeah, something. And they end up, they end up being mega, mega millionaires, sale, getting true. a bunch of fucking money. And they're like, Hmm, what car should I buy? And they remember their childhood. Porsche they're like, Oh yeah, Porsche. I should buy a Porsche. Make sure to stay you got me just, okay. They're investing in the Social future, you know? True, it's like McDonald's, they own us. Yeah, console. yeah, exactly. All right. Next, Phoenix Labs are building the next great entry in oh. the cozy farm sim genre. Yeah, yeah. Derek farm so, sim, yeah. Another one for the like bingo. This was like kind of cheating, though. There's now some exciting news that was kind of cheating, too. but Let's it counts. At Farm. It counts. Another Zero. bingo crossed off the Wait, list. That's an Animal Crossing clone and a farm simulator. Generic farm simulator. Yeah, it's both. So quickly. There's always one, dude. Good call, good call, Flo. Well done, good suggestion. It's been a breath of fresh air. I think we found Looks kind of cool. I mean, they always look kind of <laughs> cool, but... <laughs> I've just been itching to explore. As long as we're prepared, we can face anything. We can face anything. Okay, oh my stop. god, dude, I can't fucking stand this Please voice stop. acting, dude. Are you ready? Are you ready, Chubby? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it's so cringe. There it is, Faye Farm and Mortal Kombat in the same show, only at Summer Game Fest. Now, please welcome Ben Broad, Chief Development Officer, and Flannel. You're giving Chubby a chub. The developers behind the popular collectible <laughs> card game Marvel Snap. What's up, Ben? Marvel Snap. Whoa! Oh. I heck it love mobile. It's the future. Uh, mobile game. Uh, <laughs> seems like you've been very busy. We're excited about the Spider Verse content you've been doing. Lots going on over there, right? Yeah, it's been uh, it's been exciting. We've been doing a bunch of wow. new features. Some oh, of this guy's. Oh, oh, geez. Okay, man, this and, uh, guy sounds like Markiplier. Some new game modes. Yeah. 
Yeah, new game. Is that is that He's a He's really intense. <laughs> Certainly, yeah. I'm yeah. excited to announce Marvel Snap's biggest... <laughs> Jeez, what? what? Uh, we we game thought game Nick Cage was coked yeah. up. Look at this guy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this, guy is, <laughs> this guy was backstage with Nick Cage, and he's just like... Uh, in you want some? He's like, yeah. Just slap the whole bag <laughs> down and just went into the air. <laughs> Nick Cage's like, whoa, go easy, man. Go easy. He's like, no. <laughs> all right. I, I love the enthusiasm. Wow. Look at all these. That's what I got. That's you. You're made for YouTube. All right. Well, we heard you brought uh, something fun uh, with you for us to watch, right? Oh, yeah. yeah. So This looks listen, trash. I am incredible at card games, so I often win. Uh, but some people. Cringe. And maybe you've had this experience, Jeff. Uh, some people lose. Fair. And I like to think it's because they suck. No offense, Jeff. Uh, <laughs> well, dude, what is this guy? This guy is just like <laughs> might just roasting him. A little bit <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm looking at his veins. I'm like, is there a vein sticking out somewhere? Like, is his neck okay? Oh, snap. Okay, I don't have an ideal hand of cards here, but that's fine. I'll Wait, who's this? His, this guy? I feel like he I know that familiar. face. He looks familiar. He looks oddly familiar. Yeah. Why do I know that face? Each player. Is that the don't you have phones guy? Oh no, it's oh it's the vine guy. Okay. I'll play Medusa on location number two. She gets plus two power. Medusa. See the next location. Clover Dangerfield has a twenty-five percent chance of destroying your account. What is this fucking ad? He's like hold his phone is shaky phone cam. Okay. Well, I have some powerful cards in my hand, so I can just wait. Let's see the next. How much do they pay him for this? Big bar. Players cannot play Look at the camera, dude. Costs. Like, are you, yeah. And why is his why is his gamer also, mat so? Look at his gamer mat. Look at all the crusty little little bits of crust on there. Little, that was the cringiest shit I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen a lot of cringe shit. That was. Still to come, we're gonna look at Immortals of Avium from EA Originals and Ascendant, and the that world was bad. premiere first look at Chapter Four, Season Three of Fortnite Wilds. Now, if you're looking for the smartest way to level Chapter up your gaming four, this summer, season three. Nerd wallet. Nerd wallet. Is there Is another one? What was that? What was the What was the previous one from the last show? Mana. Now, did that already go bankrupt? The mana, the mana credit card dude's already gone. Replaced with the nerd wallet. I can love nerd wallet. They get me. What's this? I wasn't listening. This Lords of the Fallen? No, I do. Oh, it's muted again. I think it's muted again. Uh, Copyright music. Ah, every time, dude, it always gets muted. Oh. Oh wait, no, it's not. It's fine. This could be Lords of the Fallen. Why does he look like Giga Chad? But <laughs> <laughs> he actually kind of does. <laughs> looks like. <laughs> not saying anything either. Just got How much that, like the show is left. Ooh, uh, enough, enough for Silk Song and Elden Ring DLC. <laughs> actual gameplay footage. <laughs> Surely, it's actual gameplay footage, dude. King Arthur. Wow. Oh wow, that's oh my so God, it's cool. An, it's an iOS Android game. Oh god, what is this? This looks like torchlight actually. Do you remember the fall? The gloom descended on skylight. I oh, know it's not. You rallied to protect the beacon and paid a terrible price. You fell. Man, we really got to put in like generic generic uh live service that nobody asked for next time. Mm. Mm. Zelda ripoff? I don't think so. It looks like some live service trash. From the creators of... What? I didn't know any of those Give games. you like two seconds to see what they're actually... Because <laughs> they haven't created anything good, so they just put their games on there. It's like, quick, before they read them. Wayfinder. <laughs> okay, that looks okay. good on arrival. That looks... Yeah, mm -hmm. I literally did not care. Fortnite! <gasps> now we're any talking. Any fuckers in the chat, boys? <laughs> Puggies, Puggies, Fortnite, Fortnite. Honestly, though, the creative mode actually genuinely looks yeah, amazing. Yeah, that, that does I look got, like it could get pretty crazy. I, I, I gotta, I gotta give props where props is due. You know, we, memeing on Fortnite or whatever is is funny, but 
This actually legit looks looks really really cool. I kind of want to mess around with the Unreal editor as well. That looks that looks sick. The fuck? Is this a new game or is this still Fortnite? I actually can't tell. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh no, new game I think. Ooh, wait, Sol Stellaris? What is this? Stellaris, there you go. It is Stellaris. Hey, nice. Good call. Oh, God, I hate the canned voice. The canned, like, playing voice acting thing. I hate that. I hate the, you know, the trailers where they, like, get, get play, like, gamers to, like, talk to each other as if they're, as if they're playing uh, yeah, the game? Yeah, that's really, uh, yeah. Ugh. Nah, Ugh. Cool. It's a good way to ruin your, the hype for your game. Face trash scavenger. Captain's log. Does that count as generic survival? Four, three, one, five, nah, two, I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, what's this Battlestar or whatever? Battlestar Galactica? Star Trek. Star Trek, sorry, my bad. Well, actually, it's I don't Star watch Trek. that nerd shit, okay? <laughs> I only watch Star Wars. Oh, it's the Borg, dude. Oh, shit. What? It's the Borg, the Borg, bro. The Borg. I, I'll take a big bog on your fucking <laughs> chest, dude. <laughs> Please do. No, it's the Borg. They like take over your mind. They turn you into a Borg, a Borg boy. Star Trek Infinite. Who hasn't dreamt of duplicating oneself in order to multitask? This new hack and slash game with a tactical what? twist allows you to do just that. Okay. Sure, you Jeff. From France, here's the world <laughs> premiere reveal trailer. Who hasn't dreamed of just creating dreams. clones of themselves, dude? Coming later this year. Who hasn't dreamed of just stopping aging by drinking baby's blood? Right, guys? Am I right? <laughs> Goddess of time. Receive my life, Lisfunger. Let this power flow through you. Okay. Fight again alongside your past. Roguelike? Yeah. I'm here again. Oh, that's pretty cool. So your your whatever your old death. Like I'm fights. Uh. Oh, wait, that's actually kind of, that's a neat idea. What? You're coming with me. That's actually, whoa, that's cool. Wait, I want to play this. Combine with yourself. Damn, dude. You're not the only Looks a bit like in, Infinite Factory. I don't know what that is. Is that like the same concept but puzzles? <laughs> Runs at 3 FPS, 300 deaths. Yeah, just, the game just gets worse oh, performing the more you die. <laughs> How does it do difficulty? Like, does it cap the cool amount of clones game. you can have? Like, Next up is a brand new IP hmm. from Ascendant Studios, a single player, first person magic shooter called Immortals of Avium. It's fast and fluid. It's an FPS. Oh, is this, is this live this service? Be bad. This is live it service also has trash. A great cast led by Darren Barnett as the main character Jack, and he joins us now. Hey, Darren. Hey, guys. Great to have you with How us. You Who? Thank you. This hey. is such uh, a cool game. Super high production value. Space. He's in a show that Carissa watches on Netflix, I think. The guy you play. You're the main character Jack, right? This is I'm the... playing the main character Jack, as seen behind me. He's yeah. a dude. He looks like he does not give a shit. Yeah. Uh, His manager Brash told him it'd be a good idea. <laughs> well, uh, it's the, the game play Hands in the pockets, cool so guy. Fast -paced, yeah. So yeah, that's that's uh, me, actually. Spell, I'm actually in the game. Magic. Like, yeah, um, what it's can pretty you tell cool. Us about the story and sort of how this battle made... Yeah, I, I don't really know how to play video games. I, I don't know. I, yeah, he kind of comes from nothing. He's kind a, of nerd shit. Called, you know? <laughs> rat, is what he was. Um, but he, I used yeah, to bully really, kids who uh, played these games, <laughs> so... Kind, kind of ironic, really. Becomes part of the immortals, which is like the elite... Like, yeah, I guess people change. People grow, huh? And they are in the middle of an Really come out of their shell. You know, I'm much more understanding now these days. You have a great cast. You, Gina Torres, in it. I actually messaged one of the guys I bullied on Instagram and told him sorry. Yeah, I've grown. It was a really, really good healing process for me. Oh, Parts of the game, right? Yeah. This is the wild part of the game. This trailer is going to be showing you the immortals and myself. 
confronting Sandrak directly, who is the top villain of this game. Holy straw, um, man. Trying to end the Everwar. And it's uh, taking place in like one of the most badass levels of a video game I've seen. We're battling on I haven't seen any video games. Uh, <laughs> in the middle of the ocean as it moves around. Um, it's wild. So let's take a look. Uh, All right, let's take a look at yeah. some brand new Please get me off this stage. It is a really badass scene because, like, I'm in it. You know, like, you see my face. It's, like, so <laughs> badass. <laughs> Oh, is that that's the the, the the from from Star Wars, from the Star Wars Ooh. game, it's the same woman. Who? I don't know her name. I just know that she's in Star Wars. Have they just spent the whole budget on actors? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> EA original. They have. Oh damn, dude! Is this like another? It must be set in the Pinocchio universe, dude. Pon the the, Pin the Pinocchio universe. Pinocchio. <laughs> Knots. We'll catch him, sir. God, this looks so bad. Yeah, this looks really. Why would they? Good. Wait, wait. Why would they end on that? Five knots. Is this the end? Northeast. Oh, okay, oh wait, no, that's even the show. Oh shit, dude! It's the ship from Halo. What? The mothership, dude. Look at it. Mothership. What do you reckon? That's a cutscene, and not actual. Like, you can't actually do that. You can, you can actually. Oh, grapple? you can definitely not. No. Nah, there's no way. You, look, look, look. They look like from Halo. Double jump. Oh, kind of. Yeah, I guess. They Maybe. even shoot the red plasma, dude. Look at that. So what you're saying is they copied Halo. You're right. They yeah. did. Wait, is he flying? I'm confused. What's he? What? Yeah. What? Why didn't he just fall? This I just mean, looks really not good. Oh, he's got like levels at the bottom there, dude. Like it's fucking Skyrim. Yeah, oh, this looks really. God. Not fun. <laughs> this looks trash. <laughs> oh man. Like this, I don't know, dude. Like, what is, what is that reticle? Like, what, I know it's like right in the middle of the screen. Everything this in like... this game looks like really overdone. Yeah. There's just for way sure. too many shapes and shit. Like, too much going on, and I can't it's see like... what the fuck is happening, dude. It's trying like. 10 seconds as well of dude, the U yeah, and then jumping. Dude, you're right. The UI looks really bad. Like, it looks terrible. It just doesn't shit. look fun. No. And, like, the whole thing with the magic across your entire screen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's, I just, like, there's so much clutter on the screen. Like, what? Yeah. And your hands, like, the, the like, look how much of the screen is taken up as well. Like, I don't know, <laughs> yeah. man. It just feels uh... weird. This kind of reminded me of Forspoken a little bit. You know, just like a bunch of flashy effects. One battle mage. I want to fight this war as one of you. I'm an immortal. <laughs> he doesn't even talk differently. He just sounds... <laughs> I'm an immortal. I just want to put their head in the toilet and give them a, a flush. <laughs> you want to go to an immortal frat party? <laughs> You can actually drink a thousand beers before I even feel it. This is my superpower. I'm gonna take a shot off your girlfriend's tits. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> dude. <laughs> That's just how in character he is on stage. <laughs> uh, it's the opposite, dude. He's nothing like that. Now, one game that constantly reinvents itself is Fortnite. And tomorrow, Chapter 4, Season 3, Wilds. Oh, wow. And today, Summer Game Fest is debuting the cinematic trailer. Man, the fact that Fortnite... Dude, Fortnite's still going hard. Like, props to Fortnite, man. Pretty crazy. I mean, it helps to make, like, absolute truckloads of money. That does, that does help with development, you know. Tron. But here we go. It's still cool that it's like still going, you know. We should hop on the Fortnite one day, dude. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Remember that one time we played Fortnite together and and we just got our ass beat by Darth Vader. He just like came and True. S That's right. slapped down nuts around. Yeah. That was really weird, dude. I think I was probably like laughing. Juice World or something? Cool. <laughs> Juice World. I know. I thought it was a rapper. My bad. <laughs> Didn't they add Snoop Dogg? Oh, I'm sure they did. Helps is made by Epic itself, so of course it gets the best algorithm on their store page. Yeah, but I mean, getting the best algorithm on the Epic store is, I mean, whatever, dude. 
<laughs> yeah, true. Does anybody actually buy anything from the Epic Store, or do they just get the free shit? Yeah, literally. I feel like everyone just goes there to get the free games. Yeah, I've never bought a game. Wild. Some Epic. of the games you get on Epic, some of them are actually like pretty good games. Yeah, I, I I always miss them though. I missed. You know what's yeah, funny? I, I missed I missed Death Stranding, and then I bought it, and then it and then, and then it went free again on Epic. <laughs> they did it twice. Rough. Transformers! King of the Dome. Optimus Prime! Oh shit, dude! Bumblebee? Oh, Damn! Where's, where's Bumblebee, man? Maybe they couldn't get the rights. Oh my goodness. Transformers in Fortnite. Dude, why wow. is he not tra why is he not transforming? What the fuck? Yeah, good question. Yeah, why don't you just turn into a truck bitch. and then drive them all out? Yeah. Should have rolled out. <laughs> Damn. Very cool. Why is he so tiny? It's part of the law, okay? There's a there's a deep law explanation. I don't have time to, to walk you through the extensive law of why Optimus Prime is now normal human size, okay? What you're about to see but there's a reason behind it. World premiere. A new look at an expansive world we can't wait to explore again. Elder Scrolls? <gasps> this Elder game oh, comes wait, from wait. a studio that surprised the world and redefined the RPG genre with its iconic characters oh, and rich wait. storytelling. I don't think, I don't I think this is it. I want to thank them for this trailer this for one of gaming's most anticipated upcoming releases. Is it Elden Ring? Rumors Elden Ring. We're true. Uh, not Elden Ring, fucking Wait, Elder Scrolls, isn't it? It's no. Elder Scrolls. What? what is this? Why is everyone like cheering already? Is this oh, Final, it's Final Fantasy. Fantasy. Ah, okay. Why is he hyping that up so much, dude? I don't know, man. Dude, I, I thought he was talking about Fantasy. fucking Elder Scrolls 6 for a second, and I was like, mm. yeah, same, same. That's what I was thinking. I think I said Elden Ring, like an idiot. My bad. I mean, okay. I mean, people are really, really into this series. Like, yeah, this that's is like, fair. This is I guess like I just the... personally don't give a fuck about. It. <laughs> yeah, this is like one of the peaks of the of the series that a lot of people care about. So I guess it is pretty big. But yeah, I don't really care either. It does look cool though. Like, I, I yeah, think, it looks nice. I think when the full thing comes out, because they're doing like releases, asking me this. um. Like this like episodic, I guess, releases when it all when it all sort of finishes and they have the full Final Fantasy VII like complete edition. Oh, or is this whatever. Final Fantasy VII? Yeah. This, oh, so this is so the the first the first Final Fantasy VII remake didn't like didn't give you the full story. Uh, it's like being released in parts, and I guess this, this is the, the next part. Right. Raven, what's up? Raven. Silk Song coming soon, Raven. You're just in time for Silk Song. Silk Song trailer. Release date trailer. It's gonna be this year. Uh, November. Pretty sure this is the last trailer, dude. Wait. Nah, it's not, though. <laughs> it's not, though. I'm not gonna look at the time it. thing. I'm not gonna uh, look at the time okay. thing. No, no, no. It's, okay. it's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. I think this it's is not. the big finish, dude. It's not the... No, 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 no. They're not gonna finish. Nah, no, no, no. Silk Song's bigger than this. Surely. Silk Song's bigger than this. People, more people care about Silk Song than, than they care about Final Fantasy, right? Surely. Surely. Uh, uh, Is that Andrew Tate? <laughs> Bald guy equals Andrew Tate. <laughs> Did he do the sexy dance moves like he always does? <laughs> he did the stripper moves. <laughs> <laughs> uh... Just one of those like like poor English voice acting Final Fantasy characters, just like. <gasps> oh my god. Andrew Tate is stripping naked and oh, oh, he's oh, he's dancing. <laughs> yeah, they make they always make that sound. They always just like oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's Sephiroth. It's Sephiroth. 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 Oh, whoa. You burned my village. Do you know that I killed her? So, 
Oh no, dude, spoilers, what the heck? Actual spoilers. You killed her in the trailer, man. Rebirth. On two discs. Why did <laughs> someone just say, on two discs? <laughs> <laughs> Why would they put that in the trailer? It's on two discs. To PlayStation 5. Nomura-san, thank you so It's like, much. it's only being right. released twice. There's, there's only one, there's only two copies of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. That's it. Oh, no, dude. It'll be in the indie showcase, right? It'll be, no, it'll be in the indie showcase, dude. It's, it's an indie game, technically. Technically, it's an indie game. It's technically an indie game, guys. Play on stream incoming. <laughs> it's not going to happen, dude. It's going to come out this year. And again in December when we come together here <laughs> in Los Angeles list. to celebrate <laughs> 10 years of the Game Awards. Thanks for watching, everyone. We'll see you soon. Oh, uh, no, dude. No, no Elden Ring or Hollow Knight. Neither of I'm them. I'm surprised no Elden Ring. I really thought there'd be DLC. That's, that's been out for ages now. Yeah, yeah. Damn. Okay. Whew. Unlucky. All right. Well, I mean, that wasn't... I mean, it got, it got better. It started out pretty weak, the show. But it yeah, got better. Definitely. It definitely got better. What was your favorite part? Um, Dude, I hate how Alan Wake 2 got so much screen time. Yeah, that was not cool. Space Marines was cool. Baldur's Gate was... Uh, I I'm, can't wait for that game. I mean, Baldur's uh, Gate... We already knew about Baldur's Gate, though. Yeah. Like, the release being it's so It's just soon. nice to see shit. It's just nice to see shit. Because like, yeah. I feel like it was kind of like... It was a little bit quiet for a while, so I was like, fuck, it's going to get pushed again. Yeah, Spider Man's coming out soon. Actually, that's true, Raven. That's, well, I don't that's... have PS Five, so I yeah. Uh, I yeah it's gonna, it's gonna take a while to come out on PC. I'm sure it'll come out on PC, but it just oh yeah, longer. probably won't be for like another year or something like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I liked. Yeah, I think Space Marine Two. I'm pretty. I'm pretty. Like, I didn't know it was gonna be co op. That's pretty. Through. That's pretty cool. Yeah, the that fact is that cool. it's co op is is really really big news actually. The Sonic game looked cool. Oh yeah. yeah, the Sonic game was pretty sick. I liked that. Um, they had some Path of Exile too. That was pretty cool. I mean, it's good to know that. Path of still... Exile too. That's true. Yeah, that's. It's it's good to know but... that's still being worked on and stuff. You know. Yeah. Uh, Mortal that, Kombat. I don't know. really care about Mortal Kombat. No, neither. What, what what Lord of the Rings dwarf game? Really? They barely really showed any of that though. Yeah, I feel like it didn't really show what it was. I, do you have more info on that game that we just don't know? Maybe that's why you're more hyped for it. I was definitely confused as to like what it actually was. See, I'm trying to think. It's a hard. You know, you know, it's a harder pick for me. The the most shit announcement, like the worst thing we saw. There was a lot of bad stuff. There, there. was a lot of bad stuff. I yeah. I think the the most like trash thing was probably that Immortals of uh, Avium with old mate that came out on stage. Oh, the one, yeah, with the yeah the, the EA original, whatever it was. Or yeah, that was or that looked really bad. That looks really just not good. Like it looks like it's like one of these games where they think it's like they're trying to make it be like this really over the top epic game, and it just does not look like. I'm cool. gonna, I'm definitely fun. gonna forget about that game. There's no oh, way. 100%. Like, I'm gonna hear like like oh, Immortals of Avium, you know. And I'm just gonna like, see wait, on Reddit when game. it comes out, everyone will just trash it, and Dunky will do a video, and that's when I'll remember <laughs> about it. Uh, Under the Waves is the only one I can see myself actually playing. Really. Out of all that, man, that must have been a shit show. Oh, yeah, that Under flow. the Waves looked like a cool game. I wouldn't play it, but I'd like watch you play it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I just don't play those sort of games really at all. So. Yeah. I just Where don't play it? games. Oh, Lies of P. Actually, I'm really excited for Lies of P. The Pinocchio game. It's definitely it's a Pinocchio. Fucking Pinocchio. It, dude, it it's is not Pinocchio. It's fucking Pinocchio. It is Pinocchio, dude. Look it up. It's, it's Pinocchio. It's Pistachio. It is. Linked a different trailer Lies of Peas is a thrilling Souls-like that takes the story of Pinocchio. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. Not Pinocchio. That's right. God damn it. God fucking damn it. Lick my real boy dick. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> oh yeah, Prince of Persia is kind of cool. That's so weird. <laughs> <laughs> like my real boy, dude. Yeah, I kind of just like sort of blurted out whatever was like in my head. 
Maybe I should have revised. <laughs> maybe I should have revised that a little more before. I, you know what? Never mind. Let's go. You want to watch the indie one? Uh, sure. <laughs> Look it, bitch. Yeah, I, I gotta find the indie one, guys. Hold on. Give me a sec. Oh. We're not done with trailers yet. Oh yeah, wasn't there a demo? Are you gonna play the Liza P demo? I think I will. Yeah, for sure. I'll play the Liza P demo after Are my. You check how big it is. You might be able to download it and watch it. Uh, do it now. Tonight? Nah, I can't do it tonight, man. I gotta like, I gotta, Why not? I gotta get off, dude. I gotta get off, and I gotta start packing. Like, literally, as soon as I stop this stream, I'm packing up all my computer shit. That's it, dude. It's all, it's Aren't all getting boxed out? up tonight. Yeah, I'm, I'm, dude. I'm oh. gonna be in the new house. I'm gonna be sleeping in my new place on Monday. No more it's, streams. It's all gonna, yeah. We're gonna be, it's gonna be a stream break for like a, at least, at least a week, maybe more. There's more. Oh. Yeah, there's the indie one. We want to watch the indie one. Uh, what was it called? Day of the Devs. I think so, yeah. Save the devs 2023. Don't worry, guys. I'll stream. You can watch me play Dota. <laughs> you hear that, I guys? I know you've all been waiting for it. You can watch me play low MMR Dota. Everyone follow and Chubby. Not interact. And not are you going to stream whatsoever. Red Dead? When are you going to stream Red when's, when's the Red Dead playthrough coming back, huh? People loved that. Uh, Probably never. Nah, I don't <laughs> know. Maybe I'll jump on one day. Now's the best time while I'm on break. True, I can take advantage of your audience. Hmm. <laughs> I'll blow up, baby. <laughs> My goal is to blow up and act like I don't know no one. <laughs> uh, okay, I think it's this one. I'm doing the. We're on GameSpot now. <laughs> Three hours of me putting my credit card in, but. <laughs> Korea. <laughs> I gotta buy boxes. Boxes. <laughs> uh, so good. All right, I'm on zero. Change my thing there. I too am on zero. Uh, okay. Wait. You ready for day of the devs, dude? Ish. Three, two, one. Click. It actually starts soon. Oh, it's like a minute. There's just a minute. Go to of 50. Screen. Go to 50 seconds. 50? Okay, wait. Let me go to 50 first. Uh, 50. Okay, I'm on 50. Okay. Three, two, one. Click. I don't know how loud to make it. Double fine. Wait, it's still just a blank screen. Oh, there we go. Cuphead. Nice. Cuphead. Isn't there a Cuphead 2 coming out? Or am I crazy? I think you're right. I, I thought that got announced, didn't it? Did Cuphead 2 get announced, guys? I can't remember. <clears throat> what is this? Is this like a trailer for the actual Day of the Devs, or is this like a Cuphead, legit Cuphead thing? Available now. Uh. Oh, physical edition. Oh, they never had a physical edition. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, there's a collector's edition. You get a little Cuphead book. That's cool. Dude, have you seen that game? By the way, there's like this shooter game that got that's like got massive hype online, um, called Mouse. It's kind of like that's the the 1930s cartoon style, but it's like a first person shooter. It looks really cool. No, I have to look it up. This thing has really grown since it started. Ten years ago, here in San Francisco. Might turn it up. Oh wait, I gotta put the subtitles on, guys. Sorry. There you go. It is a bit quiet. Yeah, okay. I, I thought I thought so as well. I'll turn it up a little bit. Uh, it's on full now. It's full blast. Is that okay, guys? Yeah, it's really quiet on my end as well. I think it's just a quiet video. Yeah, he's just not talking very loud. Event and a digital showcase, so people from That's the best I can do, guys. All of these amazing games. We had record number of submissions this year. If the trailers are if the trailers are quiet, then then I'll I'll mess with the system settings. I'll mess with the OBS settings. Hope you're excited, and please, without further ado, enjoy the day of the devs. Digital showcase. <laughs> the fuck? Okay, dude. There'll be effects on that. It's what are you eating, Raven? 
I'm pleased Describe to Matthew. a brand new game from a team that is near and dear to my heart. This is from Greg Lobanov and a team at Wishes Unlimited who made incredible games like Wander Song and Chicory. Here's their new title, Beastie Ooh. Ball. Beastie? World premiere. Okay, it's still pretty quiet. I'm Greg Lobanov and I mm. am bouncing off the walls. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mess with the, with the, with my system settings to turn it up on my computer. computer. Introducing Beastie Ball. Where's the sound sound settings? Uh, app volume. Beastie Ball is a turn-based RPG where you coach a team of beasties to play Beastie Ball, which is kind of like volleyball. You is that play better, a guys? Customizable coach character, and you can explore this huge open world, recruiting all kinds of beasties. To that sounds pretty good to me. Then you can challenge rival sports teams as you rise your way through the Beastie Ball rankings. Is this like Pokemon, but like volleyball? Yeah, it seems like it. Beasties are Whoa. highly social creatures that evolved to play sports. In their natural wild state, they're constantly playing Beasties. Dude, I wish more indie games had like non-cartoon cutesy art styles. I know they, I know why, because they're like really easy to draw, you know? I don't know, dude. I wish I wish more indie style, games took more risks, art style wise. Mm -hmm. uh, whether they become besties or rivals or partners or sweethearts, they'll get some kind of unique combo ability that only that pair of beasties can do. This does look. I mean, this looks kind of cool. I feel, dude. I feel like I would love to play. I hope this game comes. I see. I hope games like this come out on like mobile. You know, because I would. I feel like I'd play this kind of game like really while I was taking a shit. Emphasize the beasties agency as living creatures. Why are you taking a shit? Yeah, dude. Join your team okay. Dude, there's a, there's a, there's a genre of games out there, man, that are like taking a shit games, you know? I think this is one of those taking a shit games. One of the user user defined tags <laughs> on Steam. Is that a roast or anything? No, it's it's not a roast. I'm not saying it's a shit game. I'm saying it's there's a difference between a shit game and a taking a shit game. A taking a shit game is a good game. But it's like good in short bursts and it's good for, like, like in it, situations it, it, where you can't do, really do anything else like, like in a situation where i'm not on a personal computer and i can play like better games that are bigger and like you know whatever sit on there for like an hour yeah and i can like really like just you know yeah, like obviously I'm not, I'm not gonna play if i if i had the choice between this and like elden ring i'm gonna pick elden ring every time right but i can't play elden ring while i'm taking a dog to actually do sound effects this game is about sports you come from a tiny town built around a nature preserve. You're kind of underdog. Dog until doing one day voice acting. League shows up and starts tearing down just, is this just like a family that made this game? Your That's kind of cute. Way to stop the construction is to rise all the way to the like top it. of the Beastie Ball League. Oh, look at the doggo right dude. From the start of your adventure, you'll be able to see all the ranked teams on your map. You decide where to go, who to challenge, and in what order. And every time you defeat a ranked coach, the other ranked coaches become stronger. So no matter which way you go, you'll have a tough and exciting ride. The house looks so cozy. So nice. It's mm. a really special project for us. And, and they just like all live together and like do, develop the game or something? Uh, I guess the house like doubles as an office maybe? Very, very yeah. Or they, or like they just place. chose someone's house because it's like, it's good for the aesthetic, you know? Yeah, it gives like a... It's like a family aesthetic, you know? Awesome. You wanna, you wanna, yeah. it's, like, it's like supporting a family business. Heart machines, follow up oh, this is Hyperlight Breaker. When you talking about this before, Flo? You'll assume the role of a mercenary with some serious skills. You'll be entering the over. I never played the first one. I never played Hyperlight. I think it was called Hyperlight Drifter. Lush rolling hills to deep labyrinths. They'll be comprised of I heard it was pretty good though. And procedural elements, just how I like my levels. Like its predecessor, <laughs> it'll be <What>? chock full. <laughs> of <laughs> <laughs> Oddly sexual. <laughs> Why did she do that? <laughs> You'll face off against enigmatic enemies. Armed with an arsenal of weapons, I play Drifter. Like really like, good. Of your previous I feel like she's really and trying to like fans that have been eagerly awaiting express excitement, but just like isn't. This <laughs> is Hyperlight Breaker. Hello, I'm out. Yeah, I mean, Probably a lot of the people doing this are like and devs, you know. They're not like yeah, people, like a lot of bigger companies are like hire people to like talk about it, you know. That's true. That's true. Whereas My it's bad. just the, the I'm being an just, asshole. Yeah, yeah. You're being insensitive. You're right. I am. This looks pretty cool. I wish I had some more, uh, more cool music, cooler music going on though. Mm. I don't mind the peaceful music, but 
Not while you're I feel fighting, like you should man. have like tech like you should have rap. Oh no, you're right. We need the riot rap. First of its open world game. Yeah, nice. Keep doing that. Make it's making the trailer better. Nice. You play alone or with friends cooperatively. Looks a bit like Fury. Yeah, kind of. Narrative will be presented fully through visual storytelling, or you'll discover and Oh, visual storytelling, dude. Wow. Long ago. Looks pretty cool. Every world will be different, loaded with dangerous creatures, razor sharp. Creatures, Looks like Genshin Impact. Long dead civilization. <laughs> I love Genshin. New discoveries in a mysterious, vibrant, but horribly ominous atmosphere. Each biome in the world is different. I don't know. I just I hope there's like because it's like open world and it's also roguelike. I just, I don't know, dude. I just don't. I feel like that's a bad combo. I just don't see it. Dangerous, unique. It, like it, maybe it, like it changes the world a lot and makes things interesting somehow, but I don't know, dude. Unlock new characters, upgrade your. I just could see it getting pretty boring pretty quick. We've learned so much from our previous games, building up amazing tech and a deep well of knowledge. But I mean, these guys know what they're doing, so hopefully it's especially it's cool. All that incredible work, and we're excited to have you experience. Yeah, I don't know. You wouldn't play this? Mm, nah. No. We'll have a lot more information mm, I so. the game as we come close. I don't think I don't think any of the things really that are going to get announced in the indie showcase are things that you're going to actually play. <laughs> I'll watch you play them. <laughs> <laughs> and now, in true Day of the Devs fashion, we're trying Like how my rating of games go like, "Oh, I'll play that." I'd watch you play it. I'd never watch you play it. From developers. <laughs> oh, that's like the three stages. <laughs> that's how I rate games. I'm thrilled to bring you a world premiere title. That is not uh, only relaxing, Metroidvania roguelike or open chill, world roguelike. Vibey, yeah, I think I, I think I think Metroidvania is a better games. idea. I guess I don't know. I just does everything have to be a roguelike? Like, I don't know, dude. Just make a just make an open world game. We'll make a make a Metroidvania. You know, like have to be a roguelike, dude. I like how the indie showcase just always has these people like in their houses. You know? Yeah, true. Does everyone just develop from their house? Apparently. Our first game, Simpler Times, sheds light to the beauty of the ordinary and serves as a place from the past where you can be present. Simpler Times follows Taina on a heartwarming journey through her memories as she prepares Do sheets to leave so comfy? her childhood home. Mm. Oh, man. Would you sit on this? Starting to I need to have a look at them again. Back. Yeah, wait, maybe they, maybe they, maybe they show it again. Savor the present moment by immersing you in Tina's world. It's we're just like you. <laughs> favorite. You have a house, right? <laughs> Through Surely. Storytelling and mindful interactions, you will journey alongside her as she delves into her past and uncovers. I don't know. I like. I, sometimes I like these like just walking simulator story games and like chill puzzle games, but. Not very puzzle, often, Taina you know. Grows closer to adulthood and you'll be there to guide her. From it looks like it has got some pretty cool like puzzles there, though. I'll we'll give it that. To more complex ones, like building a birdhouse. You'll interact with I just wish that games of this genre, like, really had more I interesting be... settings, you know? Like Outer Wilds. Because, you know I don't know, I don't mind puzzles, it's just like, I feel like a lot of a lot of puzzle games these days are just like, they're all very chill and they're just set in someone's house and there's not a whole lot going on. And it's like, that's fine, I guess, but I just wish there was like some more, some, some more epic, epic puzzle games, you know? Mm. Dev life is hard, no monies, can only afford a record player. Dude, record players are expensive, man. It's all records. So that's a premium product these days. It's hard to believe, World War II be puzzle game win. Yeah, exactly, dude. We want to build a Where's the Warhammer 40k puzzle game? For the world <laughs> around us, encouraging you to reflect on your own memories and experience. True. Simpler times is coming soon on PC. Where's the Mortal Kombat puzzle game? Space Marines 2 puzzle puzzle game confirmed. Thanks for taking the time to listen. We hope you'll enjoy playing Simpler Times as much as we enjoyed creating it. Bye. Bye. It's like Bye. Is the beach and growing up is the sea. Can I still take all these That's profound, man. With me? That's yeah, deep, brother. It's deep, bro. It's like childhood is like the beach, bro. You know what I mean, bro? 
adulthood it's the ocean because you gotta step into it brother yeah it's like you can't just stay on the beach forever man yeah even if you want to and even if you try that the tide's gonna come in bro it's gonna come in it's gonna take you wash you out to sea man get caught in the rip brother you can't fight it or you drown you just gotta go with the flow dude you just gotta let it pull you wherever I'll life take takes you, you out <laughs> maybe you get maybe you get washed out to another island bro you never know <laughs> Oh, man. No matter where you go, bro, you can know that it's where you belong. It's where the universe wants you, brother. We don't choose it. It just takes us. Oh, man. What's an old photograph doing here? Oh, it looks like The Witness. Oh, no. You can... Did you finish that, by the way? No, it, I, it's on pause. I'm, I'm, I am gonna finish it legit. Oh wait, that actually. Whoa. Did you just shift that's cool. Reality? Wait, that's oh actually. God, the voice acting is really bad. Is unique is the central mechanic yeah. where you're using a camera and pictures. To wait, that. Wait, this actually looks fantastic. That's cool. Yeah, it's a cool concept for sure. Ways. It's such a unique experience, and I think. Oh. Just gonna have a different oh. how they play viewfinder. That's cool. And that's just a really nice thing to it. Ah, perfect. That's cool, man. An elegant solution. Yeah, that's super cool. Dude, I'll dude, I'll play this. I'll play this for sure. Hmm. That doesn't look right. Had it on your wish list for a while? You I gotta have it on my wish list. It looks sick. If I was to compare Viewfinder to other games, I'd say it's like the gameplay of Portal combined with the visual illusions of Superliminal or Antichamber. That's People sick. People also compared it to The Witness and there you go. Uh, yep. Manifold Garden and various other... Oh yeah, I never played Manifold games. Garden. Is that game good? It's a puzzle game, but it's very sandboxy and playful and open-ended. <laughs> the whole concept of when they started it. That's it. Yeah, I was gonna say, what kind of fucking. Like, you can make some wild like, shapes with this, right? Like. And, you know, that's just a very important lesson in creation. View it's such a cool concept. I know. Like, I can't. Yeah, I, I, like, could not imagine thinking this up. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. Well, this, I mean, this is like. A, the programmer in me is, like, wondering how they like what the tech behind it is you know like how they're even Each character comes from yeah doing it's like it. take the picture yeah. and then actually create the yeah like this must have taken the thing ages is, to code like, yeah because you can take a photo of whatever you want by the looks and then just expand it like it's weird it's crazy so we tried to sort of make these special spaces it must capture like whatever it must capture the, the, the like pre-capture the 3d object in whatever the photo is right so it looks like a photo but you've already got like the object saved yeah, something like that. In 3D yeah, space, be. right? Like, that, yeah, it, it must be. <laughs> yeah, surely. I think it's like, yeah, I think it's just like saving it's the 3D object. But then how does it even do... Oh, that's sick. That's so cool. It's so cool, yeah. What did you miss? You're missing this amazing concept for a game, Raven. I'll definitely play this. This must be the next stage. Let's go. Oh, you just missed it. Unlucky. Rough. It's called Viewfinder. You should watch the trailer. We what you get for going to wash your hands, you just yeah. lick your fingers clean of the Dorito dust. But yeah. Next game didn't actually just come suck them dry. Okay? Next time you everywhere. suck those fingers. Suck his little piggies. This next one actually came from Twitter because we were posting all these amazing gifts and we reached out to your DM and, and asked him to feature the game. Right. Uh, so here it is. This what the beautiful, heck? gorgeous, hand-drawn ghost story called Haunty. And drawn. Hello everyone, my name is Leo Dasso and I'm with Moonloop. Together we're making a game called Haunty. Oh. Okay, looks pretty cool. What is happening? The main mechanic in Haunty is that as a ghost you can haunt things and get access to their abilities. <laughs> It did he, man, could they have chosen anyone There's else in the dev team? Like, variety of things that you can yeah, just sounds yeah. so monotone, bro. I feel like I'm watching a lecture. <laughs> the big mechanic of 
haunty is that you, have a lot of you fun can sort of haunt around things. To see what different things you can haunt and the S abilities. This game is it. really fun. Trust me, you'll love it. This guy has the opposite problem with the Marvel Marvel Snap guy, you know. However, yeah, that can like you imagine? Can you imagine this, this guy and the Marvel Snap guy like presenting a single uh, game together? Creative ways to use the Be perfect. <laughs> is that perfect fun balance? Yeah. The challenges in the game. It's always the indie game devs that make pretty games. Yeah, true. Like I said though, I do I do wish there was a little bit more variety in the art styles though. A lot of it's like cutie cutie stuff. Although this does look pretty unique. Actually, yeah, it's pretty cool. Very detailed. In fact, it's hand hand drawn. Yeah, oh wow! Look at, that, look at that effect. Oh, no, okay, no, never mind. I take that back. Stars, no, this game is very different. The stars have this special ability that we'll be completing each other's sentences. I think the Marvel Snap guy would just be interrupting. <laughs> True. <laughs> the environments and characters are all carefully crafted with a. 2D hand drawn styles, so there's a lot of painstaking frame by frame animation work in there. And yeah, that's sick. We have a fantastic soundtrack. Damn, dude. Every, the, all, all of that is hand drawn, bro. Imagine that. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. That's fucked. That would have taken so, so it all long. Sort of comes together yeah, to give you this for sure. Tour through the afterlife, chilled out experience. It's crazy it's like it's hand drawn it's like almost like a two and a half d this sort of style as well yeah sure like the perspective yeah it's cool it's it a lot that's pretty cool that's cool yeah for sure yeah, yeah. Game, you gonna play it <laughs> no <laughs> i don't think i will independent games festival but then shortly afterwards both the game and its creator vanished that game was Cart Life, a slice of life. Cart Life. To put you in the shoes of various street vendors and task you with setting. Oh, wait! You can be a you can be a street vendor. You wow. mean a dumpling salesman? <laughs> this game puts you, you hot dog in the stand operator. <laughs> this game puts you in the shoes of a minimum <laughs> wage worker. <laughs> Escape reality. Do you ever want to start your own hot dog stand in the middle of New York City? Well, now you can. <laughs> Oh, man. What the fuck? Finally out there. Yeah. What is this? Uh. Hi, oh, shit. I'm, I'm with Ad Hoc Studio. That guy just jumped off the, off the building, life. dude. What the heck? Did he Pro commit Sudoku? I don't know. Developed by Richard Hoffmeyer and was originally released in Retail Simulator. Where he won a bunch of awards at the Independent Games Festival. For a variety of reasons, he ended up pulling it off Steam, but all of us at Ad Hoc are such big fans of Richard's work. Now we're partnering with him to help bring it back. That's kind of cool. I like that. Divorce papers aware? Oh no, I think he did I think he did Sudoku dude. Jesus. Way too real. In Cart Life you can play as three different characters in any Yeah, you know this is just like a depressing like fucking but what they all have in you know, like, is like trying to make social commentary or something, you know? Yeah, Noemi for sure. Is a recently divorced mother and has moved back into her family home with her daughter, all the while trying to establish her new coffee cart. To be a barista. Andrews oh, is a cool. Ukrainian immigrant who is trying to put down roots in a new town. Ukrainian immigrant. Oh store. no. And Vinny has Sad big egg. dreams, but never enough money to make it happen. He's hoping that selling his homemade bagels will help turn things around for him. Dude, what's the bet? This game is just like a highlight of like the. <laughs> what the? Fuck? What the oh my god. <laughs> That's like some bare ass there, dude. I was about to say, I was about to say, what, what's the what's the bet? This game is just like a, some kind of capitalism thing where you just never make enough money to be able to True. afford to get by. Me <laughs> when I get ready for work. <laughs> so a friend of mine, um, he keeps complaining about this guy in 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 his. He does like a film course. There's like, and there's this one guy in his film course apparently that he he keeps he keeps like bitching about him because he's, he's apparently he just never stops saying me when I. 
have with each like he says it for everything entirely up to them what? he's like everyone's yeah so like he like like he just says he just says me when i in for all things so he's like you know this release is gonna have it's like it's like so it's like if you say like oh you want to go to the store or whatever and then he and then he just says like me when i say yes to going to the store on PC and console you know? later this year. Oh my god. When he's like, when he trips over, he's like, me when I trip over. <laughs> oh. my, my friend was telling me about this guy. He's like, I'm just so fucking sick of it. That's, that's very <laughs> odd. Very <laughs> peculiar behavior. <laughs> Dude, imagine walking around with a guy just like, me when I. For everything. The last couple years in games, and as we get me when I fuck your mother. Things are getting a little more avant-garde and daring. This next one gives you all that e, when I open the door that you crave, but with a heavy helping of demons and brimstone. Uh, this is the world demons. of Hellscape. Hellscape. <gasps> oh. Ooh. Hello. My name is Jordi van den Busse, also known as Quibble Cup. I'm the CEO and I thought I knew that guy. Dude, my brother used hey, to watch the fuck out of this guy, dude. Hellscape. He was a. Uh, he was the. He was like the kids YouTuber man. He he was like the family friendly Minecraft kid, wasn't he? Minecraft YouTuber, yeah, him yeah, yeah. Was, I've seen a video about some dude that him. It was like him and like two other dudes did Minecraft videos together or some shit. Yeah, I've never that, heard that, of them, but they're like huge. That guy, no, there was like one of the guys got like into a huge controversy for being like a pedo or something. Like yeah, some weird pedo dude. Too slow. Dude, my brother used to was. love watching Bubble Cop, man. Hellscape takes place in Vertime. Here you play as Anton Falcon, a skater through and through. All Anton wants to do is skate. That's pretty cool. Wait, team. it's like Tony Hawk, but demons, dude. This looks sick. Kind of cool. Different. To stop him and his skater friends from doing what they Tony love. Hawk games are back? The skateboard mechanics are very similar to the arcade-like games such as Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Yes. Their lead game designer Steve actually worked on Tony Hawk's Underground. There you go. Started That's cool. A long time ago, the idea and the far off, far flung land of 2002, I worked on a game called Tony Hawk Underground. Damn. We Damn, dude, classic. classic. Oh, shit, dude, the memories. You have all these stats and you're upgrading and all this kind of stuff. Oh, super damn. Cool, super neat, right? But of course, we're bound to Tony Hawk, we're bound to the real pro skaters. It always seemed to me that, that skate graphics create and imply such an interesting world, but it's not a coherent world that you can visit. So that was one of the motivations behind Hellscape. Hellscape is a skateboarding roguelike game. It fuses together old school. Wait, roguelike? Oh, dude, why does everything have to be roguelike, man? I <sighs> with a roguelite it's like the new survival, dude. Uh, man, it's like the new survival craft. Like with other games in the roguelite genre, death is I mean, I guess it's kind of similar to like the old school. I mean, I guess, uh, I guess, like if you really think about it, the old, the old, old school Tony Hawk games were technically roguelikes, right? Everything. You keep your resources, oh, which you can use. Well, because you had like a timer, upgrade, such as tattoos, and like you would always have to, you'd always have to like repeat, like like you'd only have a certain amount of time within levels, right? And then you just have to do it all again, and you're you're hoping you know, to get like high scores and stuff. But that was how the old Tony Hawk games worked. It, it wasn't until like the the PS2 PS3 era, when the PS2 PS3 era came around, that's when like they started becoming like actually open world, you know. Quite but they didn't do that at first. But that was due to the limitations of the tech at the time, you know? Like, yeah, true, true. They don't have that limitation these days. Did you miss Silk Song? No, but it's coming. It's gonna be it's gonna be the big announcement at the end of the day of the devs. Obviously, we've got a lot of uh, huge huge hits here. A lot of really popular games that we're seeing. Look at yourself. Your wing, your arm. What do you think happens when that gets to your head? Thank you for watching this reveal of Hellscape. Okay. Dismissing the game would mean the world to us. I'm keen for that. I'd play that. That looks fun. Oh, it's like a big... Oh, it's bosses. That looks sick. In Damn. our last game, Henry Halfhead, you play as half a head. That's it. That's the game. But it's so much more than that, too. Because, you see... <laughs> Henry can be many things. That's it. That's anything. the game. But it's so much he more. Curious ability to be able but to it's not. <laughs> I lied, you fucking idiot. <laughs> You'll live the life of a title character, <laughs> navigating sandbox situations crafted by Zurich based developers, Lululu Entertainment. And Where's Zurich? Is that Germany? Maybe ponder the philosophical mm, questions. Sweden? No. Who is Switzerland? How Switzerland? Is, what is it? Hey, look it up. Henry Where's Zurich? Welcome. May I introduce you to Henry? Henry's not just anyone. Switzerland. If there anything, Switzerland. There, well, everything. Oh, Henry cool. Henry can transform into everything in their reach. Yes. 
everything. And that's how they manage oh. to the familiar noise. Oh, you can be. Dude, it's like a mattress with a dildo uh, on it, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's I love found, my life. We found your mom's mattress, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, classic. Oh, you can be the battery. Always ready for their morning routine, which they usually start by making their bed. Oh, you gotta make the bed by becoming the bed. <laughs> only leads to regret. Later. Oh my God. If you want to change the Oh, world, even better, bro. You have to start off by making your own bed. Completing this simple task in the morning gives Henry a little bit of pride and the feeling of control over. Making your bed, cringe. With part of the morning routine I would never. done, Henry was ready to freshen up. Imagine making your bed. Imagine changing Actually. your sheets at all, ever. Actually. Imagine not just sleeping on the crust. <laughs> the crust makes it better, dude. It it, it, it makes it it's, it's Henry could sit healthier there. for your skin. It gives you sleep know? texture. Yeah, yeah. It makes you feel like you're camping. True. <laughs> it feels like you're sleeping on the dirt, you know? But it's, it's, it's just crusty like leaves. Cum. Yeah. Henry bought a turmeric soap. They didn't know. They just liked the color. It's actually great for their skin. Just like my cum sheets. Mm. Oh, you can be our bubble, dude. Bubble. The, the dirty what? bubble from SpongeBob. Can you be a? Can you be a piece of shit? <laughs> can I be a turd? <laughs> that got all the dirt. Henry should now dry it himself. <laughs> this, uh, this is kind of fun. I'm not gonna lie. Henry is now ready for a proper breakfast. Very odd game. Breakfast Again, like, how does someone come up with the home. idea for this thing? Like, so is keeping up with the news. Crazy. <laughs> This has got to be like some like like drug thing, right? That's all for now. Surely. Like you know, like like bro, what if you were only ahead? You had nobody. You, you just had the power to be anything, you know? <laughs> True. The best drink Henry can make from beans. Become what's inside your mom's nightstand. <laughs> 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 Henry the vibrator. <laughs> well fed and well informed. Uh, that's fucked up. <laughs> Can you become like a gun? You hate your job and want to kill your boss. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the lunchbox and leaves now. They can you had a terrible childhood and want to take it out on your, your <laughs> classmates. <laughs> Henry's been hired for a hit. Henry's Become a bomb and place yourself <laughs> under a car. Henry, everyday life with a twist. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh, that was pretty cool. is from Yeppy Carlson. A creator who is perhaps best well known for his work as master puzzle creator on Limbo. And <gasps> master puzzle creator, Limbo inside. inside. Those were really good games. Part of Double Fine Presents. Heard of Rhythm Limbo? And I think I haven't played it though. But... Co-op arcade shooter Thoth. Two of the most famous. Limbo is creepy, man. There's like this big spider thing, and it just fucking like Truly impales you. Mm. Yeah, it's, it, dude, it's it, yeah, that's, it's a creepy game. His new game sees him teaming back up with Jakob Schmidt, composer of 140. Applying his trademark puzzle skills to a beautiful, mind-bending game. This is Cocoon. Cocoon. Hello, I'm Jakob, co-founder and audio Hello, director Jacob. of Geometric Interactive in Copenhagen. I would like to He's a real gamer. Look at that. Team has been yeah, look at that, dude. Look at that PS4 collection. Dude, he's console yeah. gaming, though. I don't know what that did. He's Anna probably Perna? got a PC as well. Oh. Dude, if Anna Perna, if, as well, man. if Anna Perna's backing it up, you know it's good. Is, did he have a PC as well, did he? I imagine he would. He's a game dev. He probably plays PC games as well. No, he develops games on his console. <laughs> he, de he develops them all in the Fortnite. In the Fortnite uh, Unreal yeah, uh, the, engine. The yeah. Fortnite Unreal Engine thing, yeah. That's how every game's going to get made now. It's, dude, it's your mum. <laughs> <laughs> it's me coming out of your mum, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Joe's my cocoon. It's an adventure game with multiple worlds. <laughs> okay, dude. Okay, dude. 
You're back. Welcome back. We're watching the, the indie showcase now. Exploring. Whoa. Whoa. Just like that, we are cool. now in the world outside. With the power of the PlayStation 5 SSD. <laughs> Come on, you can just walk through the that, surely. I hate fences space. like that in games, man, where, like, it's clear that so the character dumb. can jump over. Just make or, like, it so I through. cannot make it through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Make it obvious. Just, just put in the effort to at least make it so it doesn't look outside. like I could just you fit can through the fence. World, I hate that shit, man. Or, or, like, when they're just, like, ankle high, you know? Mm. And the character just can't, they can't jump or whatever, so you just can't walk through it. So dumb. Is this like the Rick and the Morty thing where it's like <laughs> he made like a world within a world or whatever? Is that where he like lives out his whole a whole life in like a simulation thing and then he like Doesn't no, does one he have a little box or whatever where he like he goes down into it and like he's just an asshole to everyone and he he's like tells like everyone that given the finger is like the you know like a hello or oh, whatever. I was I was thinking of the one where he like lives an entire life. Like there's like some there's some there's some virtual game you can play. Oh, like, that one's funny. That's a funny episode. Actually. You like plug into it and then he like lives in an, he like lives an entire lifetime out and then yeah. he just like <laughs> wake, he just like wakes up out of the game and it's like been like an hour. Yeah, that's right. You can use the hierarchy of worlds within worlds to solve interesting puzzles. For example, to safely avoid this moving barrier. Oh step gamer, I'm trying to fit through this wide fence, but I am dummy thick and my ass keeps keeps me from passing through. That's a quote. That's a quote for sure. Get quoted. Another another one for the bot. Another one for the bot, dude. Only about exploration and puzzles. Within each world, you have to face a mighty guardian. I docked myself. No. Point uh, ad. <laughs> oh, it's like an octo balloon from Zelda, dude. Are oh, you used to playing that? Yeah. Nice. Why would I stop playing Zelda, bro? The heck? Hey, I, I'm just asking. What the that. heck? Damn, look at these boss mechanics. Oh shit. Like a whoopee cushion? What's he flying on right now? No idea. Oh damn, dude. Epic. We hope you look forward to exploring the mysterious Not playing for like two weeks now? Oh no. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take a massive break too because I won't have my shit set up. I won't have my stream stuff set up. I don't want to play Zelda with it like off stream, so I'm gonna have to wait. It sucks. Yeah. Uh. I took a break from streaming. Actually, playing games has been hard. Yeah, true. I got a lot of games in the backlog that I probably could launch, and now, but I'm just like, ah. Oh, but what if I want to stream at some point? French you know, Canadian developer that always gets me. In this relaxing artistic exploration game, you play a painter with a watercolor brush. Okay, I'm gonna pull that up next. This game is more than appropriate. Now we, we got we got to set up internet. Game Fest edition because its title AP in French translates to the word summer. Setting up internet's usually pretty easy. You just make a Hi, phone call or whatever. Hello, and I'm the creative director it's at usually pretty, It's usually pretty smooth. We are a small Montreal based in the studio working on our It's more so setting up all the gear and stuff and like and like not so much getting the internet connected. It's more so like getting all the wires and shit like like getting the internal network all, all hooked up in is the day, hard part. You see the world through the eyes of a painter, with every surface acting like a blank oh, canvas. Oh, this is pretty cool. Fill it with color. Oh, look at this! It's like a little painting, 3D painting game. Damn, dude. Wait, how do you actually paint? Does it? Do you get to choose French the color? Well, it doesn't look like you do. Canada, as you step to the shoes of a painter who's traveling abroad for well, the summer. This is a game for people who love pure exploration. You're free to roam open city scenes at your own pace. Pure exploration. Else, no challenge, dude. No fucking... No, no... Where's the boss battles, bro? Where's the Elden Beast at, dude? 
When you fill something with pink, on, man. you'll extract its color as droplets of experience. And as you level up, this game look epic. Able to unleash larger splashes of yeah, where are the boss battles, dude? The Where's the one? gun? Why is there no violence in these games, bro? Where's my violence? That's what... Decapitation. That's why I play video games, dude. I don't play for this fucking this you art so shit. Dude. I want to live out my fantasies and yeah. brutally yeah. beat children. Wait, whoa, 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 what? Huh? <laughs> my bad. <laughs> it was a joke. What? It was a joke. Oh, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Using your bike, what the you fuck? Can travel quickly back to your apartment. You mean you mean in games, right? Like beat them at campus. beat them at COD and Fortnite. Yeah. Right? Yeah, duh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In game. In game. In game. He meant in game, guys. That's where your creativity comes into play. At your easel, you can I'm not even gonna read that out loud, Oak. Because it's a risk. Because it's a risk. That's the massive Monk of the OS right there. In 3D and even recolored. The canvas is pretty much your sandbox that lets you put your own spin on commissions. And if you're feeling inspired, Whoa. you can paint as many creative artworks as you like without any kind of limitation. <laughs> what in four? With hundreds of unlockable stamps at your disposal. Yeah, look at this. Of commissions to inspire you. The only limit really that is your That was pretty cool. Apart from living your not as not as good as AI art though. Painter, you'll <laughs> also get to meet other like minded This game artists, is pointless, like just like AI every artist. Photographer and Theo. AI can just do it now. Among many others. Wait, wait, your time, you fucking loser. Maybe they'll let you in on their best kept secret. An I can paint just as good as you with AI. Your very own painting studio. But you'll have to dive into that story for yourself. It is coming out they just try recreating your starting <laughs> student screen. <laughs> 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 lovingly crafted. <laughs> okay, dude. Uh, it, yeah. Oh man, there's gonna be a hype Everybody game, dude. It's not gonna be just all painting games, I swear. Break, break, talk about the long and complicated process by which we accept games into the nominating committee and all the legal. Wait, why are they talking the about this? rules that go with the accounting of the. Tim, sorry, I, I thought that. Yeah, I thought I was doing something here too. Oh, I thought they were actually gonna talk about that for a second. Okay. Hey, Kelly from Indie Mega Booth here with a very exciting announcement. We're back. Why teach English when AI can do it? Yeah, true. That's actually true. true. Why teach anything when AI can do it? Just have AI teach. Why us. do anything? Why live? Wow. Well, <laughs> yeah. Like Why have any purpose? Over the last decade, AI just makes any everything obsolete. The best up and coming indie titles. Games like. Crypt of the Necro Dancer. Why even be alive? Tunic, Disco Elysium. Disco Elysium! <gasps> oh, Celeste. Mini Metro, I love Mini Metro. The Stanley Parable. <gasps> and Papers, Please. Oh, those are all, all bangers, dude. Community. If you're a dev, you'll likely know us from our industry work, such as our GDC showcases, our presence at Bit Summit, our global outreach and events, including a robust oh. scholarship and grant program. And if you've never heard of any of this, well, that's fine. Just think of us as like Just had a two hour training at work the other industry. week about the rise of AI in video games. games. With each other, yeah, wicked. New games, I'm keen for AI voice a acting at least. There's a lot of a lot of games that can't afford voice acting can get voice acting, Indie which Mega is kind of cool. Has been in hibernation during the pandemic, but we were so excited to announce that we're I'm finally waking up from our big long like. slumber, and we're ready to move <laughs> forward with IMB 2.0. Head on over to our brand new website. IndieMegaBooth.com and B. Don't let me into my zone. Don't let me into my zone. Upcoming showcases, digital sales, and the best ways to help support the games and developers that you know and love. As we've always said. Oh yeah, Fogs, dude. Do we got we gotta play Fogs, man? Mega. You wanna play Fogs with me, bro? You wanna fog it up? What the fog and dude, fog dude, is fog? Dude, no, seriously, let's, dude, seriously, all, actually, let's fog. Really let's fog. Let's fog. I want to fog. I want to fog. So I, wanna... uh, it's from the <laughs> I actually want to fog, dude. Uh, no joke. Uh, they're famous for the I'm gonna fog you up. You know I really want to fog. Dude, it looks about. fun, man. Uh, have you uh, have you never fogged before? I've never fogged. It'll be my. I'm a virgin fogger. No, I like hurting. So am I. We we can do it together. We can explore. We can fog together. We can take each other's virginity. Our, our, our fog virginity? Yeah, yeah? Yeah. No, it actually looks fun, legit. Hi there. My name is it's called Nesbitt, Fogs. And I'm the founder and creative director of Land and Sea. AI We're character creator when? Best known as the developers of the Alta's Adventure. Wait, wouldn't you, if it's a character creator, wouldn't you want... Years, we've been busy why would you want AI to do that, though? And laying the groundwork for our most ambitious project yet. Oh, wait, you it's mean... Oh, you wait. No, no, no. I know what you mean. I thought you meant, like, an in-game character creator. No, I've misunderstood. 
And we're super My bad. excited to be able to share this exclusive. Well, they already have AI and character creators. So please take a look and I'll be back at the end to tell you more. You got multiple friends that worked on it? Dude, did you see that? Oak's friends made they made fogging. They made they made fog. They, they made fog? They made fog. We can fog thanks to Oak's friends. Damn. Dude, I loved these games actually. Altos? I used to play this on my phone. See, now that's the premium take a shit game right there. Altos? Doggy! Damn, it's really pretty. Have you ever played the mobile games? The, the snowboarding mobile games? The Altos or whatever? No. Dude, they're actually. Never heard of them. They're probably the, one of the best, like, actually, actually good phone games. Legit. Yeah. They're, re they're really fun. I don't say that a lot about I hate phone games normally, but I like I like Altos. Both of them. They're really good. Is this like a sheep herding game? I don't know. Where'd they go? <gasps> Disappeared. What the heck? Summer Hill. A folk tale about life, loss, and livestock. Okay. It is a it is a cheap game. We hope you enjoyed this. Oh, <laughs> you reckon it is? Yeah, yeah livestock. That's what livestock is. Dude. Is a like. story-driven puzzle game in which you play as a young shepherd and their dog. Oh my god! You. Yeah. Oh my god! Together, it is a shepherd, dude. Where's the grass growing? Indy. Can't wait. Can't wait for the. Can't wait for the. The artistic grass Some growing game where you watch grass grow, but control. it's about like loss, Fluid, you know, and it's about love. And striking pastoral landscape to tell you have to learn when to when to cut the grass to yeah. help it grow. And yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's visual storytelling, dude. The blades of grass, they tell a story as you watch them. There are a few people or places that haven't been impacted in some small way by the practice of shepherding. Even the name, Summer Hill, is a name often given to highland pastures where sheep are taken to graze during the warmest months of the year. In many ways, sheep herding Damn, is dude, look at that lamb, bro. Look at really and think about all the euros you can make from that, man. Tradition. And tell a story that well, lamb's really baby sheep, dude. That's, that's not lamb. We're also super oh. excited to be working again with our oh, time collaborator, Todd Baker. Too Todd old, dude. Todd is a composer and audio designer. Best Wait, let me see. Uh, how, old, how old is lamb? Dreams age and our very own like what is the course. age max 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 lamb age age of lamb between three to six months to oh dude system. i can't eat lamb we'll anymore now that i know that bro if they're an adult it's mutton thanks again and we look forward to sharing uh, can you make lie, dude, you can eat lamb dude lamb lamb tastes so good I hate it's the fact fucking that delicious. so good. Next up, we have an it's on fucking delicious. Uh, yeah. From Studio Sci, essentially a one -person team with a few friends helping I'm just out saying, like, side. if lamb tastes so good, now, you've heard the other, the infants of other species uh, taste good? The other white meat? I'm sorry, Greg. I know I shouldn't be interrupting Day of the Devs. What is this? What the fuck is this? But it's urgent. A virus has turned most of us into... Into... <sighs> Greg Kun. The eyes of cringe. A dating action game. I think I. I can't say it. I can't admit it to her. I think I need to get something to eat. <laughs> what? What? what uh, these moments, why can't you to have to say it? You gotta be a man. <laughs> Fighting for our lives, uh, I wonder what she's thinking about me. Why isn't she saying anything? <laughs> <laughs> That's actually got to be a line from a game or something yeah. from a show. <laughs> oh man, dude, we should we should totally like voice act some some weeb game. True. I feel like we could do pretty good at that. Hey. <laughs> 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 My penis. <laughs> 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 Yeah, no <laughs> shit. <Self -aware. laughs> yes, it's... 
Oh damn, dude! dude this looks like <laughs> the mini games kind of look like you know the porn game porn game ads. <laughs> this game will make you come in five seconds. <laughs> you have last thirty seconds. <laughs> This <laughs> is so boring. Okay, I don't think I really care to watch the rest of it. I don't know why. I just don't really care. Oh come on, that okay, that, there's no more weed games. Truly. Comes a nostalgia fueled gadget building sim that demystifies. <laughs> yeah, I like how that game was so boring that, that you <laughs> that you just wanted to stop watching the whole thing. <laughs> it was so bad. <laughs> oh, this looks cool. It's like a soldering game, dude. Wait. That's actually sick. I love the feeling of seeing something happening on a screen like this one when I rotate the knob or I press the buttons. And this is where the idea for retro gadgets Whoa, comes from. Whoa, this is cool! Is to be able to build digital gadgets with little effort. Whoa! We love, uh, Pico 8 by Alexa Lock. Wait, is it actually like... this retro environment where you can build your own... Wait, yeah, is it actually... Wow! Can, is that, is that accurate? Can you like Shen make... By can I you like so. make stuff and then like actually do it in real life? Level programming effortlessly. Whoa! I think you were saying you can actually make games in it. Both worlds and adds a layer of hardware building Wait, that's actually amazing. That's so cool. Like a game about making devices that you can make games. <laughs> that's like, what? We have a fantastic Watch someone make actual like Pokemon like red or something, you know? Like, yeah, what the fuck? That's actually, that's so cool. That's crazy. And, uh, check them out. That's and wild. The gadgets <laughs> that's the sick. And we have big Wait, why wasn't this at the main show? What the fuck? That's Hi. so cool. Retro gadgets, dude. I'm wishlisting that for sure. What the heck? Mars that looks good. That looks so good. You very I don't know if that's a stream game, though. I've got to be honest, guys. <laughs> Watch you make some trash fucking device. Our next game poses a very important question, though. Sure, curiosity can tell us the weather on a planet millions of miles away, but... Dude, my nose... Oh, dude, my nostril is blocked, man. I think I'm getting sick, bro. Oh, no. I know. You're beginning the task of carrying all shaped objects from point A to point B by assembling... You're right. And in doing so... Why did I do that? Pepperoni-based problems that truly matter. Hello, I'm Ian McCarty. Me when I snot. We're a small team based in Melbourne, Australia, <gasps> and we're making this game. Okay, crikey. Mars First Logistics. Oh, there's so many boogies. In Mars First Logistics. Don't get sick too late. I am sick. To establish you gotta watch this, dude. It's an Aussie game. Mars. You'll oh, do this okay. by transporting often awkwardly shaped oh, My pants keep falling down. B, it's really annoying. That you design and build yourself. Blimey, mate. Wow, look at this great game. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, this looks boring as fuck. <laughs> Come on, Australia. <laughs> <laughs> you oh, gee, you got the pizza out, man. You got the fucking idiot. The game will give you new toys to play with. Okay, it looks like it could be fun. I don't know, just the tr when he's picking up the pizza, it just wasn't happening. I was just getting really bored. <laughs> the first thing I thought of was like a drill dough. Is that weird? <laughs> <laughs> My finest creation. <laughs> yeah, actually, maybe, maybe this is a fun game, dude. This is like the this is like the best part of Zelda, is the kingdom, but in a game. True. They copied Zelda. I'm really good at making stuff Fringe. in that Zelda game too. Uh, from what I've seen, no, you're not. This game, this game needs the, it, it provides the challenge that an engineer like me needs, you know? <laughs> As is there booger, is this not coming out of my nose right now? Let me look at No, I think it's actually like, it's about to leak, dude. I'm about to leak boogers, dude. Liquid booger is going to be like gushing out of me soon. Oh, 
Oh. One of the main challenges <coughs> in the game. Is oh no, you're getting sick through Discord, dude. You gave me a virus. To destination using the parts that you have. Oh, it's like a Korok. <laughs> oh no, dude. Rough. Little robot boy. It's like a Hilux. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Wait, is that, what, is that what a Hilux does? No. Oh. <laughs> so in Toad stuff, you never know the Hilux. There it is. And as you build up your collection of parts, do you have a Hilux, dude? More creative options no. become available to you. I wish. And I think a lot is of that who I think it's supposed to be? Is just messing around and being. Joe? <laughs> that's, no, but that's a good good one. It was it. I thought it looks kind of like Hitler. Okay, dude. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm sorry>. Relax. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> okay, dude. <laughs> you'll see. You'll see what you want to see. Uh, no, I'm not. Nice. On the 22nd of June. That's just two weeks away, and we're really looking forward to seeing what everyone builds in the game. Thank I like you. how he's holding his ears because the rocket's launching in the game. That's funny. He's nice talking touch. slightly louder, like this. You'd think the <laughs> aftermath of a worldwide flood would be pretty bleak, right? Well, UK and Denmark-based studios... I Jane was too. Has a <laughs> Smashing. Idea. From the studio that brought you Mutazione <laughs> and Sports Friends, <laughs> the all-new adventure set in the sprawling flood world of Salt Sea. The adventure unfolds differently with every decision. I'll wait for a good spot of adventure. In your next playthrough. <laughs> so buckle your swashes and get ready for the world premiere of the stylish, seaworthy Salt Sea Chronicles. Is that the full name of the game? Stylish, seaworthy, stylish, salt, seaworthy sea salt Sea Chronicles? Damn. Hello. Oh, we're in a team's call. We are Fabrique. Nick Lynn from Deguta Fabrique, and we made Salt Sea Chronicles. We're super stoked to show you the world premiere of Salt Sea Chronicles. Whoa, dude, look at it's the, look at the, world, you can click on stuff, bro. Game where you play as a ship's whole crew. Didn't you, don't you love Monkey Island? What are you talking about, dude? <laughs> Monkey Island's cool. It's okay, different. Dude. Okay. That's totally different. <laughs> beginning of the game you're going to discover was someone yawning in the background or was that you missing and <laughs> I, was, I was doing my copium sound dude <laughs> oh okay i thought someone was like screaming in the background of your like the game, thing you decide where to head next who to explore with i'm not being held here there. at gunpoint guys don't worry <laughs> that you meet along the way. <laughs> he's not forcing me to be here salty chronicle is unique art style is brought to life by beautiful Such animation enough. Are we going to have to have a talk about this later? After stream? No. No. Because you know what happened last time. I know. Okay. Yeah. That's good. One of my favorite locations Sorry. Is I, I know you. I look, I know you love your family. You love your family, right? I do. I do. I do. You do? I love this stream, dude. I love okay, being good. here. Yeah, yeah, good. good. As you explore, I'm glad. You a brand new trick -taking You're a loving guy. It's good. It's good to hear. It's good to have yeah. priorities, yeah. you know? Yeah. My priority is a stream. You know that. Play it all yeah. over the archipelago Dude, I'm, I'm boogering, man. I don't have any tissues. House rules. What do you do? Another thing we're super proud of is our exploration system. Um, what do you so use towel? I have no choice. I have no tissues. In adventure games. So if you miss a clue, instead of sort of slowly uh. tracing to the other end of the island, um, you're just going to tap the shoulder. Like a giant hanky. Or select a screen span arrow to move My grandpa would like would walk around with just a hanky, bro. It allows us to lay Dude, I had a friend who was like a couple years older than me, and he, as like a teenager or a kid, he would like Souls have a hanky. It was so weird. Tell a story about Dude, I swear that that thing would never get washed. And how you navigate oh no, he had like heaps. That you meet in turn is oh, he he was like packing hankies. He was packing hankies, man. He was the king of hankies. There's also a strong sense of, King of storytelling too. <laughs> so while you might be new to Dude, I don't. Salt Sea, you'll know that you <laughs> yeah. chapter or you he, he can't hang in there, guys. I'm sorry, <laughs> this is just <laughs> so <laughs> boring. <laughs> it's, his Zuma brain can't handle it, guys. This is actually worse than Monkey Island. <laughs> an incredible job. I thought it was, I thought it was so impossible. to share Salt Chronicles <laughs> with you all today. And I can't Super attention span. True. Get to know the wonderful dude, you, you, you know what? You, your dopamine receptors are totally fucking fried, zapped, dude. dude. <laughs> they, they're, they're completely non -existent. gone. They're completely gone. They're like, they're just like bottomless pits. 
next game is... It just... Sorry. You can't... You can't fill them. I gotta... I gotta... I need dopamine. I need... Uh, I gotta oh, hit creeps. I gotta play Dota. Uh, apologies, but... I, th I think I gotta get on TikTok. Uh, like, I think it's the only <laughs> thing that'll do it for me now. <laughs> like, I've... I think I have to just <laughs> give up and... Hey, dude, you're the iPad kid in the restaurant, bro. Do you have any thought. games? I love hearing the describe their games. And You're the kid with the iPad at the table. But I wish I could hear more. I wish I Can't could sit still for two minutes. Start twitching. Can't <laughs> put up Subway so for quick. <laughs> well, making a real video game. Of seven True. Uh, I love this video. <laughs> this is actually pretty cool. Uh, two player productions. With uh, of course you do. Of seven years, uh, Walden Romero Psychonauts 2. And they made a super hyper duper long documentary series unlike anything you've ever seen in games documentaries uh, dude now that's putting that series. aren't you aren't you using your zoom and brain like is it aren't your chef is firing now dude documentaries who has access like i can't that? wait uh, so here's a, a very quick sneak peek at <laughs> i feel like i'm struggling right now bro this shit's putting me to sleep <laughs> no cap on a sack for real for <laughs> Oh man, dude, I love watching these things with you, bro. Uh, to get to the dollar amount it's just the, the fact that you hate everything <laughs> at the indie show is so funny. Hey, I didn't hate everything. A lot of it was boring. Oh my god. Oh man. It'll be really rewarding when it's done. See, I feel like I'm not even paying attention to like half the shit that I'm seeing. I'm just like waiting for you to, to, to just call it boring. <laughs> just, the only reason I'm watching this is so I can just listen to you call things boring. <laughs> uh, that photo game was pretty cool though. though. That was, uh... The photo game was sick. That was actually really cool. I might watch that Psychonauts documentary. I'm a Psychonauts Andy. To you are. Your game for future day of the devs, or did Have you, you played number two yet? Or no? No, I haven't. I've been. I, I've literally. I bought it, and it's just been sitting in my library, it. bro. Because I was like, oh, I want to stream it, but then this is like what I was talking about before. It's like you have a bunch of games you want to play, but you don't want to. You don't want to. You want to put them on stream, you know? We could not pay for any of this. I don't know. They they donate to us. Did you play the first one on stream? Didn't you? Did you finish that? Yeah, I finished it on stream. Is there more indie stuff? I don't know. Wait, let me just scroll through. Is that it? Nah, it's just like a bunch of. Thank nah, you. Thank you there's some kind of ad for something. Oh, it's a recap, I think, or something. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what the rest of that is. All right. Ever since we started doing these digital showcases, GG. Oh, GG, dude. There is the Devolver one, but but I think uh, I think I'm showed out. You know. Yeah, I'm definitely showed out. I think I'm showed out for sure. We can watch the Devolver one some other time. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, there was there was a, there was a bit of good stuff. You know, the photo game was pretty cool. Mm-hmm. I don't really remember much else. Oh, dude, honest. we should. Uh, have you seen this Slapshot Rebound game? It's like ice S hockey. It's like two v two or one v one. Slapshot Rebound. It's free. Early access. That sounds like a good community game, maybe. Yeah, 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 yeah. What was it called again? Slap, slap nut. <laughs> slap cum. <laughs> <laughs> Slapshot Rebound. <laughs> Why does it sound? Why does it sound? Oh, no, so I think cool? you can do more than two v two. This could be. This could be cool. Do I just have like brain rot, or does that sound sexual to you? What? Slap. What was it? Slap shot rebound. Yeah. I don't know. It's just something about slap slap shot. Just <laughs> sounds. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. I, I don't know. I think. I think I just have like. I think I just have brain rot. I think I have the scarlet rot. You're in the scarlet rot for show. For show. <laughs> uh, let me give it a look. Slap, slap shot nut. I mean, slap, what was it? Slap shot. <laughs> oh, there it is. Slap shot rebound. Is this it? Yeah. Dude, this looks weird as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> this is like a browser game. Cool. It's got very positive cool, reviews, dude. though. I'd play this. Yeah, I'd play Chill. this. I'd play this. You can, like, move your uh, your mouse or whatever to, like, spin around or something. And, like, to okay. take it to the puck and shit. I feel like, I feel like this game would make you scream. 
Oh, for sure. That looks kind of cool, though. Oh, man. Okay. I think oh. I'm done, so... That was a good... That was a good... How, mu how much... Did we watch three hours of shows just then? Damn. Three, hour, three hours of gaming goodness, dude. How much of it do you actually remember? You watched, you watched three hours. I fell asleep halfway through. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, I'm excited, too. There's a lot of good releases coming out this year, like pretty soon, man. August? Yeah. August has got a fair few games on the radar. Yeah, mid, it seems like there's quite a few coming out over the next, like, four months or so. Yeah, yeah. And cool. Hollow Knight in November? You can't <laughs> wait. I can't wait. Uh, you're dreaming. What are you? What are you laughing at, dude? That's fine. It'll come. Your delusions. It'll come. It'll laughing come. at your schizophrenia, dude. You're fucking <laughs> losing your mind. We didn't. We our bingo was shit again. Yeah, we're always really bad at that. We didn't get. So we didn't get. Um, we didn't get Elden Ring DLC. We didn't get Silk Song. We didn't get remake of game nobody asked for. Unless you count Prince of Persia, but I don't think that counts. Nah. Um, and then generic survival game. We didn't get that either. I could have, dude, generic survival game. Every other time that we've watched these shows, we, we would have gotten that one. Literally. And the one time I don't put Sonic. Oh man. I know. I we get so, Sonic, like, two, we get two so unlucky. Times. We get so unlucky. Dumb. It's a shame you have stuff in November. I know. I know. I'm a busy man in November, dude. So are you actually. Yes. 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 Do you remember why? Yeah. D yeah, do you? Wait, does chat know? Oh, maybe not. Actually, I don't know. Maybe chat doesn't know. I can't remember. Keep it a secret or what? I don't know. Yeah, I guess we'll leave it for now. Okay. I actually can't remember if I've told anyone. I don't know. Big day, yeah. Oh wait, did I did I tell did I tell you guys? Did I tell stream? I think I, maybe I did tell stream. Surely, I feel like you would have. I feel like I did. I feel like I did. I feel like I did. Are you guessing? Oh, maybe I didn't. Maybe I didn't. Yeah, you guessed right though. Ah. Uh... I feel like you did. I feel like I did too. I feel like I did at some point. I just didn't put it in Discord though, but I definitely did. I definitely said something. Anyways, I'm tired as fuck, dude. I'm gonna go play some Dota. You gonna, <laughs> you're, gonna go, you're gonna go play some Dota? Wake me okay, up. Man. Yep. Okay, man. Uh, let me see if there's anyone to raid before we go. Warcast. Oh, wait, should we play some marbles? Yeah, marbles, marbles, marbles. You marbles. never play marbles, actually. You're never in the marbles game. Yeah, I always miss it, dude. I'm yeah, fucking... okay. No, no, no. It's marbles time. Yeah, yeah, totally. Totally, marbles marbles time. Totally. Marbles in my mouth. Marbles in my mouth. Totally marbles time. Marbles in my mouth. Marbles. Zom like one every single time, by the way. Pretty much, yeah. It's pretty bad. Have you been keeping up with the marbles with the marbles league going on? I haven't. No, I've yeah. been a bit out oh. of out of the loop. Oh man, dude, this I feel like, dude, I feel like it's rigged. I feel like I feel like there's cheating going on. I feel like there's like some kind of mob involvement. You know what I mean? You know how like mo the mob rigged someone. the you know, yeah the mo you know how they rigged boxing in the forties? Yep. It's kind of like that. Yep. I think I I think organized crime is involved. I, legit, I think we got to do a whole. It goes deep. It runs deep. We got to do a whole corruption thing into the sport yep. because because yeah like, we need a royal what is it royal in royal what's inquisition it? no no what's it called. Fuck, what's the what's the thing called? Fuck. Royal 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 Oh dude, it's on the tip of my tongue. Commission? No. No, not Royal Commission. No, it is Royal Commission. Yeah, you're right. Royal Commission. We need we need a Royal Commission into the we need an independent investigation into the Marbles League and corruption. Because the same people keep winning every time and the same people keep falling off the map every time, which is very funny, but it could be corruption. Why'd you put my balls with Chubby Legend? Uh, <laughs> Spanish Inquisition. Yeah, we need we need we need an Inquisition. Inquisition right, right now. What we need right now. 
I can actually it. play marbles with two monitors now. I usually play it after Zelda, which means I can't look at the chat. But it's fine. I got it now. Oh. Okay. Wait, we have two hug pleasers? What? Do we? Oh my god, we do. <laughs> Please, puppy <laughs> dance. We have a big one and a small one. What the heck? I didn't know we had two. Error retrieving map list? What the fuck? No. What the fudge? Retrieve the map list, bitch. What the fog? What the, <laughs> this is fogging ridiculous, man. I can't <laughs> fogging believe this, dude. Oh, they can't fogging stop us from playing marbles. I want to play the community maps, bro. Ah, okay. Let's do the let's do the regular one. Then I'll let you choose since you're in the in the call today. Me? Yeah, yeah. You never um, get to play, so. Mm, but try to choose like try to choose below two minutes. Well, actually, probably even, probably even closer to one minute because there's there's very few people. So if we play a long, long map, then it, it won't be a close game. You know, you gotta keep True. it close. You gotta keep okay. it tight. Okay, keep scrolling. I'm I'm looking. I can sort by time actually. No, I can't. Yeah, sort by time. Sort by time. That's oh, fine. I can't click it. Oh, you're fucking lying, man. There's one that's 104. Where was that? Bongo Boogie. Yeah, Bongo Boogie. That sounds fun. You want to play Bongo Boogie? Bongo Boogie. Bongo Boogie. Bongo Boogie. Bongo Boogie. Say that 10 times fast. Bongo Boogie. Bongo Boogie. Bongo Boogie. Bongo Boogie. Bongo Boogie. I can't. Uh, all right. Explanation mark play right now. Boom. Dude, that's true. There's bongo boogies coming out of my nose. Hot. You Is have it a four v four. Oh, Ryan, I'm still here. Lurking, dude. The lurk king. All right, any more? We got any more lurkers? Want to want to get the get an emote, dude? You could pick an get emote. Get in there. Think about it. Actually, I think you already have the. I think you're already allowed to pick any emote you want. I'm pretty sure. Me. Yeah, because you're a mod. <laughs> yeah, I can I can add whatever I want. I realized that the other day when I add, I think I added something, I was like, oh, that's kind of shit because it's like people have to win marbles. So I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm not going to do that anymore. No, well, you're a mod though. That You you do extra work. That doesn't count. You're All right. right. I should. Uh, no, no more players? No more gamers? Is that it? Uh, we got all? Come on, gamers. Get in here. I think that's it. All right, let's yeah, do that's it. it dude. The record is 56. Is someone going to get 56? I guess we're about to find out. Oh. 56 seconds, guys. Who's going to get it? Who's going to get the record? the world record. Hang mods and exposure and emotes. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, dude. Okay, here we go. Did you actually? I think Zombie beat at one. Oh, Flo's in the lead. Oh, wow. Wait, how, do I get the, how do I get the names back? Ah. No idea. Wait, you I'm not. Ah. Broken it. I broke my camera. No. Oh, okay. my streamer. Wait, the, Whoa, the little the... Bong bongo noises. <laughs> Ryanide last, typical. This is why I think it's rigged because Ryanide's always last, unless he dies. I think that's why I think there's organized crime involvement. You know what I mean? And he's first. <laughs> Wait, who's who's in the lead? I think it's oh, I think it's you and Zom, dude. Oh, Flo's pretty, neck and neck. Flo's pretty close on the stairs, though. <gasps> Zom and Flo. Oh, wow. Look at that Run speed. The, the line. The, sec the second bongo. Another bongo. Oh. oh. Wait, I'm catching up, though. Oh. Rank one coming through. Oh, <gasps> oh the big oh, overtake. No. Oh, Flo's so far wow. ahead, though. Yeah, that's Flo's got it. There it is, dude. Oh, he fell off. <laughs> 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 he fell off. <laughs> So what again? Stop it's it. It's rigged. It is rigged. How much rigged. did you pay Flo? How much did you pay Flo? <laughs> oh my god. No, dude. What Actually, the... actually, you're right. We need a, we need a fucking r Spanish Inquisition into this. We need a, we need a Spanish Inquisition. We need, we need, we need an external independent investigation into Third this party. league right now. That is so, dude. She's won more than half the games we've ever played. Oh, just admit it. How much? How much did Zom give you? How many points? Oh my god! Rigged, massively rigged. Go lethal. You want in? We can play another one. I swear, <laughs> I don't even cheat. Sounds like something a cheater would say. Yeah, it's very convenient. Very convenient, dude. Just pick your emote. 
Haven't had a marble die yet today. Been marbling all day. Oh, shit. Marble it up, dude. All right, you guys pick another one, dude. Do I? Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 All yours, dude. Just, what, yeah, try oh, and pick What was that? 117. This one? Few, few will survive. Ooh. Ooh. That sounds ominous. Maybe not. Maybe not. Scroll down. Okay. You know. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ulti lane madness. Where's that one? Uh, 144? That's pretty good. No, yeah. that's that's all right. You want to do that one? Yeah, do that, do that, do that. Okay. Oh, it's like a NASCAR marbles. Wait, what? Is that it? You're zero and seven. <laughs> uh, can you can you add that emote, Chubby? Uh, yeah. Thank you, dude. All right, exclamation mark! Play, get in. <laughs> <laughs> Dog? Oh my god. No. Oh, what is that? <laughs> <laughs> oh no, dude. That's a hot dog, dude. <laughs> nice dog, bro. All right, last chance. Last chance, and you, you does should it, have wait, a. Does the winner? Does the winner get? Of this one, also get to put in a moat or no? Yeah. Oh, dude, we have like a thousand slots. We're chilling. Okay, let's do it then. All right, here we go. The big win. Dude, if it's Zom again, I swear to God, I'm shutting down this whole operation. <laughs> it's I never swear, dude. Again. We're going to play a different game for the community thing from now on. Okay, Zom just straight away in the lead. Wait. Oh, no, no, wait. It's the rank one. It's me. Ryan Eyed. Okay. Ryan Eyed might be in the lead here, but it's okay. He'll fall off eventually. Oh. Oh, this could be dangerous. Ooh. We could. Zom is no ahead one... again. Come on, man. Lethal death straight away. Zom <laughs> 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 uh, is way back there, by the way. What the? Yeah, this, well, this, this was a really. This, Dude, this is, is a... bullshit. This is actually bullshit. <laughs> again, Zom is just. Destroying this map right now. Rigged. I'm actually genuinely starting to believe that the, that there might be. There's no way. There's tampering. There's tampering. I oh, dude. Oh, 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 dude. Fuck off. Don't overtake me, bitch. She's just laughing in her face now. She's gonna win again, guys, and it's not even gonna be close. <laughs> it's not even gonna be close. <laughs> Ryan, I dead. Classic. <laughs> <laughs> the same people dying every game <laughs> and the same person winning every game dude what is the point aware <laughs> oh my god no dude I, I can't believe that is <laughs> oh my god dude wow what is the point? What is the point? Everyone else gonna die to the fire. Oh, it looks like you're gonna be second, dude. Oh. Well done, dude. Solid second. Take it. Oh, God. I'll add it. God damn it. <laughs> oh, he, he, uh, he's already got that one. Got dog oh, it's already been already. added? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's pick another one. Oh, far out, dude. Well, there you go, guys. Another, another, uh, another good community game. Another good marbles round. Well done, everyone. Congratulations <laughs> to the winners. Far out, dude. <laughs> One and ten. Zero and twelve. Zero and four. <laughs> <laughs> talking <laughs> oh my god my the, dude this chat is just nothing but dogs this is not how I planned this to go oh fuck man alright are you off then are you off to go grind Dota games for the rest of eternity yeah unless you're staying on uh no I gotta go I gotta pack up my shit man oh get yeah get the fuck out of here get the fuck out of here man Guys, uh, I am getting the fuck out of here. I'm getting the fuck out of here for like at least a week. This is going to be my last stream for 
a week or more. Uh, because I'm gonna pack up all my shit and move house. So, yeah, man. Uh, that is what it is, dude. I don't want to see you in that room ever again, motherfucker. In this room that I'm in right now. Yeah, you better you get the fuck out stay? of there. I'll if fly down <laughs> and beat you up with that Winnie the Pooh pillow. What that that one? Yeah, that one there. Yeah. Okay, I'll beat you, you up gonna, with it. You gonna beat my? You gonna beat my butt with it? I'll beat huh? your poo up. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> okay, dude. All right. Let me check the forecast. Hold on. Um. Yes, yeah, so I'll be gone for a week. Like I said, uh, is um. Are you gonna be? You're not gonna be streaming at all, eh? No, no, I can't slug you. What? Are you gonna be? Are you legit gonna be streaming at all or not? I know you said was it a joke or? Uh, no, I can't slug maybe. you. Maybe, I might. Okay, well, Chubby might be streaming, so you guys can watch him in the meantime. Maybe. I'll chuck it on the Discord if I do. Will you actually? No, no, I can't slug you. Well, I'm doing night shift now, so it's kind of hard to be honest. If I if I get some time during the day and I wake up. No, no, I can't slug like, you. I'm not too fucked. Oh, you don't have to. I might jump. I was on. just wondering. I was I was thinking about it the other week actually. I was thinking I should jump back on. Just, uh, just well. for a bit of fun. Because then it gets me to play Red Dead. Because I, I do want to finish Red Dead. Well, there you Otherwise go. I just don't play it. You know what I mean? All the more excuse. Yeah, well, there you go. Oh, my God. <laughs> the timing is hey. not right. <laughs> I was literally about to get off. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. <laughs> hey, yeah, thanks for reading. Hello. Good to be here. Uh, do we have to play one more? Are you, are you down for one more, dude? Yeah, let's all marbles. Fuck it. Let's go. All right, one whoever more wins, for the raid, whoever wins for the raid, for the raid, for the raid, for the raid. And whoever raid, wins, they can leave a mark hey, on your your channel. Here. They get to pick a, a, a fucking emote. You get to pick an emote? That's true. Hey, All right. Hello. Good to be here. All right. Whoa, holy shit, dude. Relax, relax with the follows. Oh Thank God. you so much. Open up. You guys are crazy, man. Hey, thanks for the raid, you. Uh, Brookie. Mr. Miyagi. Uh, yo, how the fuck do you pronounce that? Ry Rivendol? Yo, thanks for the raid, dude. Appreciate it, man. How was the stream? All right, we'll do one more marbles for the kings. For the kings that raided. Uh, I just so you know, the marbles in this stream is completely fucking rigged. Okay, let me just. There's point gonna that be out a right Spanish now. Inquisition into it. We got one person here called Zom who just wins every single time, and it's annoying. So please, somebody beat her. I right, do you want to pick one more. Nah, you beat you beat me. I pick okay. Is are the community ones? Are they still? No, I still can't load them. Okay, fuck. Alright, thank you so much for the love, guys. That's a cool radio emote. It's pretty sick. Uh, all right. What am I gonna do? I can do a longer one now because there's people here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Procedural adventure. That sounds shit. The brick. <laughs> bricked, bricked up, up dude. dude. Oh, we gotta, we gotta break it up. <laughs> yeah, let's go. It bricked up. All right, Xmash Mark Play, get in right now. You raid, you get involved. All right, we got some more competitors, dude. If Zom still wins, despite all the competition, I'm gonna be mad. I'm gonna be a mad boy. All right, who else isn't in? Is Ryanite still here? Get in right now if you want to win an emote. Well, not win win the choice of an emote. You're not getting another dog emote. We have competition now. Real competition. Last chance. Last call to the station. Yeah. All right, we're going. Dude, it's like NASCAR, by the way. We have a NASCAR route course. All right, I can love NASCAR. All right, here we go. Okay. Oh, is this oh, dude, a big look, look, they got colored balls, dude. Whoa. Oh, they're real. They're real gamers. Okay, Mr. Mr. Miyagi in the lead. Oh, it's a close. It's a tight, it's a tight race, dude. I gotta I gotta, gotta get in there. Dude, all the raiders are in front, dude. How do you guys how are you guys doing this? Look My at that. God, they're flying. Just a fucking raid squad here. <laughs> you look at you. <laughs> <laughs> Find the back, bro. Oh, dude. This is Bad. close, dude. I like this map. It's like super tight, you know? Like your mom. 
just like Joe. It's <laughs> just like Joe. Okay. Mr. Oh, Miyagi holding the lead firm. I brutalize Whoa. the enemy. I take them to oh. the town. Ahead. Takes it on the burn. Ahead of the pack takes the inside lane. Brilliant move. They don't teach that in school. It's Flo. I think Flo's third. Nice. Come on, Hold Flo. Up for the stream. Put it in for the OGs, Flo. Come on. I don't want it to all be I... Raiders in the in the in the podium finish. You know what I mean? We gotta have we gotta have an OG in there at least at least one. How many laps are there, by the way? Oh, there's three. Okay. Why are you Another second one, yeah. to last? Because finally the the universe has tipped in the favor of everyone else. How did You'll someone finish this in a minute 25, mind you, for the record? <laughs> mind you, for the record. Which one? <laughs> Is it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Cheating, I guess? Yeah, probably. I don't know. Yo, what's up, cool Discord? Hey, man. Watch everyone just, like, fall off the map and Zom just wins. Okay, the, the Raiders are still just sticking ahead. What are these guys doing? How are they? How are they? They, they had their wee picks. They had their way back for breakfast. <laughs> is this the last lap? I think this is it. That's the end. This is the win. Mr. Mr. Miyagi stole it. That was impressive. Oh, well done, Mr. I Miyagi. Was. Hey, congratulations on the win. You can pick an emote at 7tv.com. Feel free to put it in the uh, chat. I'll put it in the Discord. Either one works. It it's up to you. TV. Congratulations, sir. Oh, we don't think the fucking thing. I'll get it. And thank you again for the raid, man. But I really do have to get going, unfortunately. I'm so sorry, guys. Um... But I have to pack up my shit, man. I gotta move house. I, I really gotta go. Um, yeah, I'll be back on probably like I was saying before, before the raid came in, I'll probably be back on next week. Um, with some Zelda. If anybody plays Zelda, by the way, or likes watching Zelda, um, feel free to come back and stick around. Um Yeah, man. You like Zelda? Hey. We'll be playing Zelda next week, dude, when I come back from the from the moving house. So if you want to join in, feel free. Um, until then, guys, stay safe. Have a good evening. Have a good day. Have a good night. Whatever time it is, say goodbye to Chubby. Thanks Bye. for coming around, man. Thanks for watching the game Summer Games Fest with us. Um, yeah, man. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye. No, no, I can't love you. <laughs>